I just washed my hair, can you tell? Anyway, what's up? How's it going? How's life? How are things? How's stuff? Welcome to per pers 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 personal boba. Yeehaw, baby. Love me some personal boba. <clears throat> Hello. We, today, have a very important goal of uh, trying to finish this game, I guess? Um, doing our best to finish it at, le at least. Um, we'll see what happens. Um, I know I definitely won't be able to get through all the golden content today, but we are going to kind of try to blitz. Um, we're going to try to blitz the, uh, kind of the end content here. I'm going to finish P4 but reload. I have said on my Discord and on Twitter that yes, that is the goal. We're going to see if that stays, but as it stands right now, my goal is to try to finish it before I reload. Before I, I, I play reload, I should say, to be correct. Literally, Adachi's whole small town center boring. I'm going to start murdering people. Think it could have been solved if Inaba had a boba tea place. Real. I agree. <clears throat> Yeah, no, um... How our hearts to... sing in the chaos! Krista, thank you so much Let's for the 1,000 biddies. Let's go, baby! Yeah, we're gonna try to get as far as we can as quickly as we can. Um... I... I think, I think we're gonna move pretty fast here. I'm not gonna do the palace first because it's gonna cut off like a month of social link time and there are social links I wanna finish. So we're gonna try to do those really quick, but I mean it's 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 gonna be quick. Like I'm gonna I'm going to do it fast. Persona Four ends probably today. Maybe the base game at least it might. Judging by how fast I blow through dungeons, I mean yeah maybe. Typically does not take me a while to to beat dungeons and. This game is clearly not as long or not as cutscene heavy as Persona 5. So I'm not even sure like any cutscenes and stuff are going to take that long. But base Persona 4, we're pretty much done. That also means today I might ask for your guys' help and trying to finish all the fusions for Margaret. Because uh, I've barely made any progress there, and that sounds like a goddamn nightmare. Uh, so I'd like some help. <laughs> I, I did just say I'm going to try to do the social links. Yeah, I'm going to try to do the social links, not just rush the dungeon. However attempted I am to just get this over with, I want to finish some social links. Like, I do want to finish Naoto. I do want to finish Brolyoko and I. So as I wasn't paying attention. Yes. And now your punishment is that you must help me with Margaret's social link. Like, I do want to do her stuff. I just hate the fusion recipes. I just, I hate that. It's just so boring and not fun. Um. And, uh, I want to know what her deal is. Because the game tells you nothing about her. So, yeah. Are you gonna finish Yosuke? Maybe, maybe not. Yosuke can go fuck himself. I don't know. 
He's pretty low on my priority. I'm gonna be like perfectly honest. All right. Tarot cards, cards shuffled. Below daycare milf? Probably. <laughs> For the first card of the first day, our past is the five of batons. Who doesn't love batons? Or wands as they're sometimes called. Progression overcoming initiative. Yeah, that was the past. We progressed and overcame the mystery, essentially. We, we know who done did it. Uh, we know who done did it. I was right all along. I'm so right. I'm still right. I'm so vindicated. So that's kind of poggers. As for the present, the present is a reverse five of swords. Look at that. Upside down. Looks like a... Looks like a pussy. Anyway, um... We should... The swords are so yonic. I wonder why. Progress. Breakthrough initiative. Oh, that's the reverse of that. Oh, no. Why is MILF censored? I don't know. I guess it is kind of a lewd thing. Like, I mean, saying, saying MILF is like, you know, mother I'd like to fuck. So, I can only assume that's perhaps why. Um, even though I describe MILF, I talk about MILFs daily, on a daily basis for myself. I love older women. Anyway, yeah, so Five of Swords is progress, breakthrough, initiative, but it's the reverse of that, which is very much like this. I thought I meant mother in late 50s. You're joking, right? Like, you're just, you're just like, fucking with me, right? Ray? <laughs> so I guess the present is going to be the opposite of progress, even though the past was progress. That kind of makes sense. We're going to hit a roadblock here. Not get as far as we probably think, despite how badly I want to. And our future is a reverse ace of batons. Look at that. Nasty gamer. Nasty Shots gamer. are being born with twice as many toes and half the nipples, and nobody knows why. God, I wish I was born with twice as many toes. Uh, anyway, 39 months. Fen, thank you so much for the 30 plus 9 months. That's kind of poggers. Thank you so much. That's a lot of months. Drive, new growth, a creative spark. Oh, great. That's the reverse of that. That's bad. I'm going to go crawl myself into a corner now. No, Ray. <laughs> uh, but to answer your question, no, it means mother I'd like to fuck. Not mother in late 50s. I'm so sorry. Yeah, so drive, new growth, creative spark. That is what we're getting for the future, which I guess makes sense. But it, well, it's the reverse of that, so it also kind of makes sense. We're going to, like, hit some really good content in this game. And then the game's going to be like, hey, remember, you're playing Persona 4. And I'm going to start screaming uh, in mortal pain. And uh, I'm not going to enjoy that at all. So. That's what I'm expecting. It's okay, we love for the screaming. <sighs> yeah, it's five of batons, reversed five of swords, and a reversed ace of batons for our reading. Mm-mm. And we're supposed to go into the TV world with everyone. What's up, David? I'll give it a try, but if Risei Chan couldn't find him, Hi, I really doubt someone with a dried up note. Hmm. 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 Hello, Freedom of Press. Nice. I do smell a dachi baby in here. 
But the fog is completely covering up his scent. A dachi baby? What? Nice. Daddy, Welcome home, David. When you look at me with those eyes, I this is my tunnel. I'm getting something. Teddy? Hey, quit wandering around. You better not flake out on us again. Huh? I sense it from this away. Is it Itachi? Um, how do I put it? It's kind of hazy, but at the same time, it feels like I've got a whopper on the line. I don't get it. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> Very suspicious. Oh, boy. It definitely smells, but... That's weird. If I remember right, that's where Sensei, Yosuke, and Chie-chan came from when I met them for the first time. Oh. Oh, excellent. When we first... where was that? Oh. You mean that creepy-ass room where all the faces on the posters were cut out? Mm-hmm. Yep, there's someone there. Teddy, you really are amazing. We're going back to the piss corner. Let's go. It was just dumb luck. It's because that's where I first sensed Sensei in the other. That's why it kind of smelled. Oh, I see. Wait, did you say it smelled? Piss corner. The room where Yosuke had to go to the bathroom. And... Huh? You're saying... He peed his pants there? <laughs> Cause they don't know! <laughs> oh my god, the piss joke. Ew, I don't wanna hear it. <laughs> Yuki goes like, gross! Oh, you lie so bad! Dude, I did not piss my pants! She had quit spreading random rumors about stuff like that. Uh, well, it happened so long ago, my memory's kind of fuzzy, you know? You know? <laughs> Piss Soda 4 strikes okay, again. Guys, enough fuzziness. Follow me, the master of fuzzy logic. <laughs> don't, don't act like Yosuke gets thrown under the bus for no reason. He deserves it every time. Yukiko, though I really wonder sometimes about your sense of humor. Yay! They never said first the truth. <gasps> ah, judgment! God, we are we are speed running this card. Kind of feels like they. It's a late edition. I forgot how scary this room was. Oh. I noticed her first, and she just had to run off and have an affair. Oh. Who's there? <laughs> He's so angry looking. Oh, it's you guys. You're very persistent. I like his weird grin. <laughs> he went from he went from no evidence to He's having this joker moment. I already had mine. Um. Uh, anyway, uh. You're the real killer. I don't know what you're talking about. You're not lying your way out of this one, damn it. Just being here proves it. 
Answer us! You're the one who threw Ms. Yamano into the TV, aren't you? <laughs> it was an accident. She started struggling. What else was I supposed to do? I called her out to the lobby because I wanted to ask her something, and then she started getting hysterical on me. Who are you? Oh, you can tell- you can, like, tell her avatar is, like, so much, like, lower What's quality. something important you called me out here for? Got it. What they say on the news isn't true, is it? All that talk about you having an affair and whatnot, it's all a lie, right? Why do I have to explain myself to you? I see. So you don't deny it. <laughs> sure, if you want to, Dark. Lie, but it turns out you're another worthless bitch. What's wrong with you? Don't make me call for help. <sighs> Shut up. Shut up, shut up! I think you need to see what it's like to fear for your life. It'll get your head straight. <laughs> what are you going- She fell in. <laughs> Sorry, I just- I just looked at the thing that you posted, Dark. Very good. Huh. <laughs> wow. So people can go completely inside. Was he just going to shove her halfway through? Was he just going to... Good thing for me no one else was around there in the middle of the night. That happened in our lobby? Well, yeah, because then I'm up. Yeah, they am again. I learned about the Midnight Channel through some rumor. You hear a lot of fishy stories like that on the Force. But it was pure coincidence that I touched the screen and discovered my power. I do love his voice actor, too. He's doing a good job. I burst out laughing when I found out. I knew right away that this was going to be interesting. So you tested it out on Mayumi Yamano? Nah, it was nothing like that. I'm a very sincere fellow. I was just trying to punish the stupid bitch a little for betraying me. Yeah, putting them inside the TV was never the plan. But you know, both Mayumi and that dippy high school girl struggled for no reason. We're responsible for Saki Senpai's death. Okay, we need that. We that. Saki? Oh yeah, her name was Saki Kunishi, or something like that. At first, I just called her in because of work-related stuff. Her being the one who found Mayumi's body and all. And naturally, if there was any chance she'd seen something, I'd need to know, right? So I was all set to be a nice guy to her, and then that bitch. So, is Adachi's whole thing just that he's an incel? Is that his whole thing? Is that he's an incel? Because that's kind of what it's sounding like. <laughs> like his entire thing is that he's an incel who found out he could go through the TV and stuff. No evidence? Wow. Huh. The scary piano. Absolute maidenless behavior. It is absolute maidenless behavior. The scary misogyny piano. Ah! What do you think of it? It's dumb.
And it was just a meme. I know. I like I I literally made a joke about it at the beginning. But I didn't think they'd act I didn't think they'd actually do that. I mean like Cause he was old Mr. No bitches. I'm like, yeah, I'm like, it looks like a Dachi gets zero pussy. Huh. Uh, well, we we need to finish this so I can like, you know. I know that's the ironic part. Literally, Keo. What's this about, anyways? Didn't you call me in for more questions? Well, we'll get to that. But you know, I saw... You were getting pretty cozy with that Namatame. Oh. Huh. So I'm not good enough for you. Well, I know how to deal with girls like you. No! God, these high school girls today. This world's gone straight to shit. Dude, you are like 10 years older than her. Oh my God. Wow. When I was in school, I wasn't allowed to do anything but study my ass off. I was supposed to be the best of the best and instead they stick me in the boonies. But, I guess I got the sweet power to make up for it. <laughs> Life's not so bad after all. Get on your knees and beg, and maybe I'll let you out. I wonder if Adachi can push people into his phone through the <laughs> yeah, YouTuber. Like that'll happen, as if I'd walk into a death trap like that. It was a lot easier the second time. High school girls are thinner, you know? Lighter. You son of a bitch! Yosuke kill him. Uh, Kills ass. Drink. I didn't know it was dangerous inside the TV. It's not like I was trying to kill them. I mean, I'm sure they hit on Namatame, not the other way around. The council secretary will one day rise to public office himself. My Yumi and that high schooler were just gold digging. They got exactly what they deserved. I didn't do anything wrong at all. Shut the hell up! Yosuke kill his ass. What happened to my Yumi Yamano that people die in here? <sighs> so what if I knew? Hmm. No one. You already know it was Namatame who did the rest. He called the police in the middle of the night just after they found that Saki girl's body. The rest of the force had their hands full with the double homicide, and it happened that I was the one who took the call. Uh. Namatame said the police refused to take him seriously. You were responsible for that then. Oh, quite the contrary. If anyone else had taken the call, sure. But I actually did believe him, you know. Huh, that's the pattern to the two deaths so far. <laughs> Pal Pit? Pal, thank you so much for following. Super duper appreciate it. Welcome. Hope you're having a good day. And now you're seeing a girl in a kimono on that weird program, and you think she'll die too. Is that right? Tommy san do you seriously expect us to believe something like that? <laughs> oh my god. <clears throat> oh, holy shit. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I'm not even Aryan! 
did. That's not even true. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, that's funny. Sorry, I just that was really fucking funny. <laughs> Oh my god. But but it's true. If there's any way the police can protect her. Listen, there's no way the police are going to make a move based on a fantasy story like that. It does sound interesting though. B but Oh, I have an idea. If you really want to save her that much, why not do it yourself? Like you could shelter her somewhere. Some place where no one could find her. Where no one could find her? Save her yourself. You can do it. I'm busy, so I'm hanging up now. Bye. <sighs> Isn't that amazing? Of all the people who could have received Namatami's call, it ended up being me. Talk about luck! All I did was give him a little push. And he completely bought into his vision of this world. The more people you got... Both sides had the best of intentions, so the game of cat and mouse would never end. <laughs> it was awesome. You gotta be shitting me! Why? What reasons could you have for doing that? He's bored? <laughs> reasons? None, really. I could do it, that's all. And it was fun. I guess that's my reason? Hmm. You murdered people just for the fun of it? Come on. All I did was put people in here. I didn't murder them. And Namatami did most of it. I had nothing to do with any of you. You're just dodging the blame. Yeah? Then how would you prove it? He put people inside TVs? <laughs> you think the police are that stupid? <laughs> what a jerkwad! I do admit, though, I never thought you guys would manage to track me down. I like that. Games like this gotta have surprises or they get boring fast. It's like when I dealt with that Kubo kid. That was fun, too. Mm, he did put it up there. Then, you mean to say that Mitsuo Kubo's disappearance was your doing as well? I did sense something odd in his course of action. If he had special powers and wanted attention, why resort to a regular copycat crime? But that wasn't the case. Kubo had no such powers. In fact, he was thrown in by you. Am I correct? It had been a while since I last put someone inside the TV, so I really got a kick out of that one. Why did you do that? And how come Mitsuo didn't say anything about you? Ah, Willibur! Hello, Will. How is it going? Want to see a number? Ah, number! Nasty gamer. Nasty gamer. Uh, thank you so much for the raid. I super do appreciate it. For those of you that don't know me, how many of us say Zumi, Zumi, or Zumi, call me any of my streamers. All about Hussey, come vibes, be subbies for every. I mostly play G I or J J JRPGs like Persona or Final Fantasy, uh, or Baldur's Gate. That's not a JRPG, but it's an RPG, so it's close enough. Um, massive Persona Four spoilers. I'm like at the climax. So, uh. Hey, Zumi was right. In other news, water is wet. I was so right, though! <laughs> I was so right! Um, anyway. <laughs> uh, hello, Will. I, ho I hope you had fun. I hope you were doing good. What were you guys up to? Also, thank you so much for the 42 months. That's... A lot of time. Did you know that's 40 plus 2? Months? Your pockets. <laughs> Mm -mm. But also, don't play Persona 4, right? I don't think most people from Will's stream would enjoy the game. I don't think Will would either. <laughs> uh, if you're gonna play Persona B5, or I guess 3, now that 3's... I mean, Reload comes out in, like, two days, right? 
So, yeah. New puzzle game about puzzle boxes. Yeah, I saw a little bit of that. How was the puzzling? Was it fun? <clears throat> I'm not nearly enough time to play a JRPG like Persona right now. Yeah, yeah, for sure. We got cliffhangered so hard. Damn. Look at you go. Or not go. I'm sorry about that. 12 plus 11 plus 11 plus 11 minus 3 equals 42. That's kind of hard. It's real. Nice. Hell yeah. Um, that's really cool. But uh, again, uh, massive Persona 4 spoilers. If you care about those, look away, please. If you don't care about those, don't look away. Continue to stare. Uh, would you give this game a higher number now, or is this still like a 2 out of 3? Ah! So I interrupt the climax of the game. You're completely fine. Will, you are so fine. It's A-OK. -okay. <laughs> Seriously. Um, you are completely fine. Yeah, I'd probably still give the game like a 3 out of 10. It's probably, like, I'd say it's probably like a 3. More firm in that number. That's okay, this game is ass. Not great. Um, anyway, I'm almost done with it though, so that's kind of cool. But you're Pockers, I hope you're doing well. Thank you for, thank you for running in. Anyway, back to the piss. There we go. <laughs> you think that didn't occur to me before I did it? Come on, I'm a detective. I led him through to a room at the station with the TV, switched off the lights, and did it quick while he was still startled. As long as he didn't see me push him in and no one else did either, no one would believe him, even if he survived. Of course, I don't think the Kubo kid ever figured out what happened. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, I love you too, Ashley. Wait, the police station? So sick. Yeah. He turned himself in pretty quick, actually. This was back when we didn't even know enough to issue a search warrant. But the other officers decided it was just a prank, so they pawned him off on me. I didn't blame them. I mean, a kid coming and saying, I did it all, it was me. Who'd believe him? But it looked bad. I didn't think anyone would come forward and take the blame for all the incidents. <laughs> 3 out of 10. Each unit of the 3 represents Risei, Kanji, and Nanako, respectively. Correct! <laughs> the police were desperate dependent on anyone. If this kid really did it, they might have announced the case was closed. And if that happened, Namatama would stop saving people. I couldn't let that happen, or the game would be over. That's why I told the others I sent him home. I came up with the idea to put him inside the TV on the spot. The game would be over? You threw him in just so your fun wouldn't end? You gotta have some excitement in life, don't you agree? But then you guys put your foot in it yet again and ruined my fun. Thanks to you, Kubo was arrested again, and everyone acted like he was the true culprit behind it all. <sighs> Couldn't they see how badly he copied the crime scene? It worked out in the end, though, because good old Namatame kept saving people. I guess the guy started to develop some kind of messiah complex, huh? <laughs> what an idiot. I mean, he did kind of have a messiah persona shadow body. This is all a game to you. Yes. How dare you murder people? Murder Saki-senpai for such a stupid reason! <laughs> you bastard! I'll never forgive you! You can keep your forgiveness. Our world will probably become just like this place soon enough anyways. Didn't you notice? The fog's leaking out. Everything on that side's pretty much screwed. Mm -hmm. The two worlds will merge soon, and then there'll be no difference. No sides anymore. Mm -hmm. What the hell's he talking about? This isn't his real body. The real Adachi is somewhere else. Oh? But this guy feels different from an ordinary shadow. It doesn't seem like he's going berserk. <laughs> wow, you can tell that much? 
Oh, so he's a lot more proficient than we think he is. This me is just around to greet you guys, and thank you for wasting your time by chasing me in here. I'd say this world has taken a real shine to me. I feel like it's giving me everything I've ever wanted. And the monsters don't attack me at all. Maybe they can tell we have the same goal. The Shadow's goal? By the end of the year, Inaba will disappear completely into the fog. Soon, this place will be reality. I'll be in this world, so if you want me, come and get me. This world has a mind of its own. We'll see which of us it favors. Mm hmm Keep your bullshit to yourself. It's about time you shut the hell up. We'll finish this right now! What a chump! Didn't I just tell you the real me is somewhere else? I'll be expecting you all. We'll put an end to this. Get back here, you! That stuff about the world's mind and how this place will become our reality. Was he serious? The rest of his confessions were consistent. We'd best proceed under the assumption that it's no lie. It felt like... He's gained some strong power after coming here. Not only that, maybe he got taken over by that power. So what he said about the two worlds becoming one, that's really gonna happen? Makes a lot of sense. Didn't he say that it would happen by the end of this year? What happens then? I think he means this world will engulf the human world. The people in town are acting weird. It's like when the shadows that emerged from people went berserk. If the fog gets even thicker, and this town is completely shut off from the outside world, then the other side might become full of shadows, like over here. You mean everyone's gonna turn into shadows? Damn it! Damn that bastard! Damn, Yosuke. Why? We went through so much to get here. And now it turns out he was pulling our strings this whole time? His voice actor's pretty good when he wants to be. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's about time we finished this. I don't want to feel this way ever again. Oh. There's a path we can take now. I sense Adachi's presence from that direction. He's taunting us. Bring it on! Got all the danger signs too. Let's go kick his ass right now. Wait, I suggest we prepare ourselves first. You're probably right, Dark. We can't let him stab us in the back ever again. Up oh, shoot. I'm a little worried what he means by the end of the year, but now's not the time to freak out. Pretty sure Naoto was just saying like, "Hey, we need to like make sure we're ready Let's to go in there." Prepared. Let's get over prepared and leave footprints all over his stupid smug face. Hell yeah. Justice! No oh, judgment, I mean, not justice. Senpai, please don't go on alone. I understand that it must hurt, since you seem to have a personal relationship with him. Maybe that's why. I feel a presence kind of like yours up ahead. He might be calling to you. Wait, never mind. Forget I said that. We're all going together, okay? Promise us. Let's finish things before then. So I would be fully prepared before facing Adachi. Huh. Well, I gotta say... When I'm right, I'm just right all the time. <laughs> I, I'm just so right constantly, nonstop. I was even right about his motivations. Um, all the time, I'm so good at this. In my opinion, I do think the misogynistic... All the time, it's infuriating. <laughs> um, I do think the misogynistic, like the misogyny angle kind of boils it a little bit. I think they really should have just played up the fact that it's like, 
I'm bored. There's nothing here. There's nothing to do here. I'm 26 and I'm wasting my life away in this town. I did so well in school just to end up here. And what? For this to be my entire fucking life? That's stupid. That's awful. Why would I do that? Yeah, I think a social link really shows the board thing more. For sure, for sure, it does. Um, but like, I think the misogyny thing is just kind of not necessary. Like, if you ask me, board incels are dangerous, for sure. Like, you know, the whole thing is like, oh, he's like a board incel, right? Um, but like, see, like, here's the thing. Let's take Akechi as an example. My boy Akechi, love my boy Akechi. If they made Akechi like a random pervert, uh, that would make everything about him worse. That'd make his motivation worse, that'd make his story worse, and make everything about him way worse. No, Akechi's good because he's unhinged and he's kind of insane, but also like manipulated and lonely and things like that. But he's not like a raging misogynist, right? Like, he, he's not an incel, right? And if they made him one, it would just be weird and it would make his character worse. You know what I mean? Like, if if they had made it out that it's like, oh, Akechi, you know, attempted to assault someone before he murdered them, it'd just be like, ugh, right? It'd just be like, ugh. It also would kind of remove any sympathy we had for him. Um, and like Adachi, it's very clear you're not supposed to have any sympathy for Adachi, um, which is fine, but like, I don't know, just like, just like the incel misogyny, like, sexual assaulter kind of thing just seems really unnecessary. Like, they just didn't need to do that, right? They just didn't need to do that. Um, but they're like, no, he's, he's, he's shitty to women. And it's like, oh, so he's like Yosuke? And it's like, no, he's, he's like worse than Yosuke. It's like, oh, okay. Cool. Like, you know what I mean? Um, especially, it's especially funny given how fucking misogynistic the game is. Like, like, I mean, Yosuke is, Yosuke hates women. Um, and so many other parts of the game hate women. They make fun of women constantly. They make so many bad jokes about so many women in the game. And then the bad guys, like, the bad guys, the incel? And then it's like... Like, you know, I don't know, it's just kind of funny. Like, oh, this guy, this guy's bad because he, he calls women a bitch and, 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 you know, it tries to assault people. Um, and, you know, it's like, yeah, he's very different than Yosuke, who also calls women bitches. I mean, he doesn't, I guess, assault anyone, I guess, but he'll make jokes about it. So, like... I was literally sitting here thinking you can't use misogyny to highlight your villain's evil nature when everything else in the story is also misogynistic. Literally! <laughs> um, yeah, Adachu becomes a better mirror for you if he's just bored and hates the town. Yes. Yes, I, I agree. I think it's irrelevant to his core motivation. I think it's like a thing. I think what they probably did is they got there with Adachu and were like, oh no, some people might think he's like a good guy. How do we make him evil? It's like, well, he assaults women. It's like, yeah! He's evil now! It's like, the, the part of him murdering two people and then plunging a town into chaos and trying to, like, literally destroy an entire town by fusing it into, like, the shadow world wasn't evil enough? All because he was bored? That wasn't evil enough? Like, it, it just feels like a weird accessory how, um... Mm -mm. <laughs> Yosuke will merely guilt them into stripping in some way. He's not that bad. <laughs> <laughs> right? Like, 
Um, but yeah, like I, I, this feels like a very common thing that happens in stories, especially comic books. It happens in comic books all the time. Um, where like the bad guys all like, I am evil because I'm gonna blow up the world. But also, I'm kind of sad. And then people are like, oh, damn, he's kind of sad. And the, co the writers are like, oh, no, people sympathize with the villain. It's like, quick, ma <laughs> make him a misogynist. And they're like, ah, oh, brilliant. <laughs> like, that's kind of what it feels like. It's like there's so many times where, like, vi like, violence against women is used by writers to communicate that a bad guy is bad for for just the sole reason of like, oh man, we, we need to get people to not like this guy. You know, it, 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 it is very similar to the dead wife. It's very, it's similar to fridging. Similar, but not quite. Not quite, right? Um, It's like this weird thing where we protect women and children is some kind of baseline thing people are all about until it's actually on the people to act in a way that's consistent with it. Yeah, so when you got the bad guy who's all like, I hurt women, it's like, oh no. Isn't that what they did to like Dr. Light in like the DC comics? I believe that is correct. Yeah, it's, ki it's a kick the dog moment, but this time on women. Um, and that happens a lot. Like, that happens a lot. Like, we need to make a character likable. Dead wife. We need to make this character unsympathetic. He kills wives. <laughs> like, yeah, like, violence violence against women is so often used to, like, justify a villain being evil. It's like, oh, that, oh it's, he does a violence on women. Like, and that's why he's evil. When they can't think of anything else better... Even when it's staring at them in their face, the whole angle of Adachi being bored and doing this for kicks is actually pretty good. It's really good, and the whole misogyny element kind of gets in the way of that, because it, it pulls away from it. Now, she didn't need an extra dose of misogyny to cement him as a villain. And by using misogyny specifically, the story makes it seem like misogyny is only a problem when the designated villain is doing it. Correct. Um... And he stuffed them into TVs for lack of fridges. It writes itself. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, literally, like, the, um, like, it, it, absolutely what Nova said is, like, you, you feel like, it's like, okay, it's bad when you, like, assault women, but you can, like, you know, demean and humiliate them all you want because the rest of the game does that for laughs. Right? And I'm not even talking about with, like, some of the girls in the party. Like, just the way Hanako is treated throughout the entire game is so shitty. And so, like, yeah, you can do a misogyny to women you don't like. It's fine. Right? Or, or like, anything that involves, like, half of the fucking, like, social, like, events. Just, just anything. Right? Um, Teddy being weird to the women and also to Nanako all the time. <laughs> like, like, it's just, ah, uh, it's just so tired, right? It's just so tired. And again, is another classic example of Persona 4 having a really good idea, asking a really great question, and then tripping itself at the end. Like, a Persona 4 is obsessed with trying to ask big questions and do big things, but then it gets to the finish line and then breaks its ankle on purpose because it can't, like, it just can't do it. Persona 4 just can't take that risk. It just can't do it. It's got, it's got to pull back. And because it goes so far, they're so far down the hill, by the time they trip themselves, it, it's bloody. It's messy, right? It is so bad. It has some really cool ideas. And if this game centered around how misogyny is bad and, and use that as a central theme about how, hey, you like misogyny is bad. Treating people shitty for their gender is bad. And then the main villain is a rancid misogynist. That would work really well. That would work so well. But it doesn't do that. It fails. <laughs> like... 
<sighs> anyway, so yeah, it's still a solid like 3 out of 10 game. Dachi's an interesting character though, I'll say that. He might be calling to you. We're all going together, okay? Promise us. I feel like this is a bad ending. I actually don't know. Really? Did I forget to save? Hmm. You're about to get locked out of a social link if you choose wrong choice. Do I have to do this to finish Adachi's social link? Like, do, do I have to go in to finish his social link? Ah. Well, they really spooked me, but I guess I'll go in there alone. You still get rank eight for the rest of the game? Okay. Well. Think of it like a catchy. Mm -hmm. This is exceedingly dangerous. Mm -mm. This is a problem. Why didn't you bring the rest of them? You're such a party pooper. <laughs> you couldn't even bring your wannabe detective friend? Hmm. To what? Change my mind? Don't kid yourself. Your whole gang should be here. You know, work together, beat the bad guy. Friendship, effort, victory. You guys love that stuff. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Just what was it about me that made you want to believe in me so bad? Hey, Larry. Well, I don't have anything to say to you. If crimes could be solved by appealing to morality, we wouldn't need the police. The person you believed in was a version of me who only existed in your head. You decided on your own to believe in me, and that decision betrayed you. Why complain about it to me? You're a sad human being. You say the dumbest shit. It's people like you who come to me alone, naively thinking you can turn me around, that piss me off the most. What do you think will happen if I shoot you? I see saying underneath the noose, symbolic in a way.
Oh, that's great, Larry. Congratulations. Zero face animation. It's very silly, actually. It's so silly. You just... That's all it would be. Scent burning of gun smoke. Do you get it now? We're done talking. I won't miss next time. It didn't seem like a threat. Really, relationship with Adachi has changed dramatically. I am now that hard. Thou hast seen how bonds may change. The bond that have changed is thy first step to learning the truth. Thou must bear thy inner power of the gesture becoming hunger. Oh, Christ. The gesture to hunger. Want me to let you choose? You can go back to your friends and bring them all here. Or you can die now. I guess regular revenge is boring, though. Let me see where your detective work takes you. It's always good for a laugh. You're so persistent. Look at all that youthful vigor you've got. Come on, leader. Bring all your friends back here. Well, bye-bye. Entrance is closed. Seems Adachi is blocking you. Adachi wasn't the real him either. So come back with your friends, you won't be able to reach Adachi. And so go back, go back for now. Interesting. Welcome back. Oh. I told you not to go alone. Though I knew you would anyway. It's okay. I understand. Mm. I'll keep it a secret from the others. And I won't ask about Adachi for now. But come on, you should trust us more. This just seems a bit sad. Anyway, I'm glad you're safe. <clears throat> Attention, customers. It is now closing time. Please visit us again tomorrow. Today, that time will be swallowed by the fog. Should be near the end of the year. You must reach a decision by then. Prepare yourself for... That is a possibility. That's really interesting. I do like that. I like how the card... Oh, God, my screen looks dirty. It's not actually that dirty. No, it just looks dirty. Oh my god. Ugh. Gross. But yeah, no, it's really cool that the jester as a card changes. It breaks, and then the relationship shifts. That's very cool. I like that. You think or think, or is it just me? Is where it's coming to end? I actually heard someone say that. What, you think it's gonna happen? Earthquake, tsunami? Oh yeah, it's gonna happen. It's just fog, you doofus. Besides, something terrible happens. Defense force or some somebody's sure to come save us. Huh? I guess you're right. Ah! What did I monster attack scene about? Or aliens, there's some movie about something like that. Oh look, the test results, finally. No, for real, for real, I, I'm a big fan of them reinventing the formula with P6 by only revealing the real arcana of someone's relationship at rank 10. Maybe until rank 10, maybe you have a minor arcana card for them or something, or just like a placeholder card. It would be very cool if you reach rank 10 and it's like, here is the true essence of your friendship, and it's revealed to you. That'd be very cool. 
remember in my tarot symbolism, right, it's also fitting for the Jester as a variant of the Fool, embodiment of change. Yes. Yes. That is correct. Embodiment of changing and, uh, you know, diving into different things. Um, and then them becoming hunger is very interesting. <laughs> You're a genius, you. I became closer to my school friends. Yay! They love me! Unless you must defeat the one behind us all before then. Okay, so when is the actual factual last time I go? Is it the 22nd? I think it's the 22nd, right? Twelve, uh, 12, 22 is the best day to go. Okay. That is good to know. God, the card, the card art is pretty, uh, intense, too. How do you not get tired of being right? <laughs> well, you see, I'm never tired of being right. I'm God's favorite little angel. We can't see your card. I, I know it is. I mean, you guys can kind of see it. I know. But yeah, so, uh, I, I don't know, it's just, it's just kind of nice always being right. It's great. I'm God's favorite little princess. <laughs> um, mm -hmm. Truly, though, like, I'm, I'm going to be honest, though, like, tr truthfully, I, I don't think it's that hard. Like, and that's not me trying to insult anybody who, like, didn't figure it out or anything. But, like, I, I truly don't think it's actually that hard to figure this out. Honest question, do you sometimes wish you were not as not right as much so you could be surprised more? Is ignorance bliss? Yes, actually. Nah, I, I, I wish things were trickier. It would be more fun. Can't wait for you to call the entire plot of P3, maybe. Yeah, no, Dragon, I I would be more entertained by things, various things, uh, if it was more surprising. For sure. Yeah. Truth is a curse. Media literacy can be a double-edged sword. Oh, yes, it is. It was in your sitting here, screaming at your monitor going, no, no, God, no, I know where this is going, son of a bitch. And now I have to play 100 hours to see where it goes. <laughs> um, right. Are you implying that people don't pay attention to the things they read, watch, and play? Yes. It's true. So many people have no idea, that, like, no idea what half the shit that they fucking consume. Right. Um, you can see that in so much, like so much media. You can see that in so many books and movies and games, how people just take the wildly wrong, like takes out of them. A good example. Let's use everyone's favorite American Psycho. It's very clearly a, a movie that's supposed to be like, hey, this shit is bad. And then people look at it and go, nah, man, that's so cool. Or like Fight Club. It's like, hey, masculinity, like toxic masculinity will kill you. And people are like, nah, nah, that's so cool. I, I love, I love the Fight Club. Right? Like, like literally, like literally. And it's like, what? <laughs> what are you doing? It's just insane. For yeah, Warhammer 40k. Whoa, the Imperium is so cool. 
Maybe if the Imperium was uh, even cooler, people wouldn't turn to literal demons to escape the pain of living in the Imperium. Cause like, cause like, you know that's the point of like Warhammer, right? Is that like fascism and the Imperium are so absolutely terrible that like people turn to literal demons to escape the pain of living in that system. Bitches would rather worship Slanesh, because at least they'll be happy than if they lived in the Imperium. Now, the downside is, no, oh, they were corrupted. Ah. Are you also the first to call any every Daganarampa case from the very beginning? It's not that hard. Um, <laughs> but no, like, for real, for real. Um... It's just like, in, in all honesty, in all truth, like, I like to, like, talk about how much of a genius I am and, like, how cool I am and stuff, just because I think it's funny. I think it's cute, right? I'm being silly, right? It's very hyperbolic, a joke. Um, though I am right all the time. That is true. Uh, <laughs> it's also just not that hard. Like, and I don't mean it in a way of being like, oh, you're stupid if you didn't get it. But if you pay attention, like, take Persona 4. Who could it be besides Adachi? Who, realistically, who could it be? Who could it be? The next best case, like, the next best guess is, like, what, Dojima, maybe? But, like, when characters exist in a mystery and the game systematically disproves most of them pretty early on, you're only left with a couple of people could ever be. Like, like you're only you're only left with like a couple of people it could ever be, and Adachi sticks out like a sore thumb. Mm -hmm. No, yeah, I yes, Ray, you're right. Akechi is, it's immensely easy to see that Akechi is a bad guy. You can tell that so early on. But they do a fun plot twist of being like, oh no, the group knew. And they pull they pulled a plot twist on him. They got him. They tricked him. And that is cool. And that is very cool. Yeah. Akechi was such an easy guess, but the twist was that the characters knew the whole time and the player, um, player didn't know that the characters knew. And that's fun. That's fun. That's a fun way to do that. And it's a good surprise. And I was surprised by that. That's cool. Right? Because you really can't guess that. But it's really cool. Um, but yeah. It's the classic murder mystery plot. Except you get 100 hours of gameplay to solve it. Instead of 3 to three to 8 hours of reading. Exactly. Right? If you're reading a paperback book that takes you a few hours to read through, right? Chances are, you might be making a couple guesses the whole time, but it's always old man Jenkins by the time you get to the end of it. Because again, books have finite characters. <laughs> Stories have finite characters. But a game that lasts 100 hours versus a book that lasts 10 hours, you have so much more time to think and to see things and go, oh yeah, no, it's definitely this guy. Like, it could only be so many people. It could only be so many people, and there's only so many characters. Persona games have pretty small casts, especially when you consider that most of the social link characters you can pretty much immediately eliminate because they're not main plot characters. Like, I'm sorry, but Sayako didn't do it. I know she didn't do it. I know she didn't kill anybody because, like, of course she didn't. She's a missable social link. Even social links that you... Well, like, that's the thing is, most of them you can't even miss. Or, like, or sorry, most of them you can just miss. Like, if you just miss um, Naoki, it's not him that did the murdering. His sister got murdered. Right? Or it's clearly not the ball boys who you, again, can miss or choose a different one. 
Obviously the fox didn't kill anyone, right? Like, you only can choose the main characters, the story, and your party members don't make any sense. Obviously it can't be Margaret. She doesn't do anything the whole game. Um, Dojima would be a guess. Like, it's possible, but you pretty quickly kind of figure out, like, nah, he wouldn't do it. Uh, there's no way he would do it. Teddy, Teddy makes sense. Teddy, Teddy is suspicious, right? But also, the uh, again, pretty easy to just eliminate. Obviously, Yumi, 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 Yumi didn't do it. Obviously, Marie didn't do it, right? Also, like, real talk, Persona has a funny habit of, like, the DLC characters being the main villains. Like a Kechi, like a Dachi. Also not that hard to guess. The MILF did it. We don't even know her fucking name, and she did it. So, yeah, like... I know, on one hand, ha ha ha, yes, I am always right. On the other hand, it's just not that hard to guess. Right? If you're playing this game at, like, I don't know, 14, yeah, it's probably pretty hard to guess. I could see that. But, um... Well, if you're not, then... It's, uh, not that hard to guess. <sighs> So, anyway, the point being is, uh, yeah, I would enjoy, I would enjoy games and stuff more if they're, like, if their plots were, like, more complicated or, like, had more to them. Every once in a while, a game will come out with, like, a, a pretty, like, juicy story to, like, sink my teeth into. Um, but, uh, that doesn't happen often. Most video games have not, I'll be honest, most video games don't have good stories. They, they, they are just, they just don't do a good job of storytelling and are typically very simple because gamers struggle to understand more complex stories. Um, some of they want Dojima to be, uh, in the original draft to be main villain. I think that could have been cool. So... Historically, video games have struggled to tell good stories. Or at least ones that aren't uh, complex. Very basic stories. Um, I would argue, of course, there are definitely exceptions to this. Um, and video games have gotten better. Um, right? Like, I can think of a couple of Final Fantasy games that are pretty good. Right? Even some older ones that are pretty good. Right? Um, but, like... Compare, like, I don't know, the story of, like, I mean, Mario. Pretty much any Mario game, most Mario games. I know someone's going to bring up Thousand Year Door. Stop it. I mean, I'm talking about other Mario games, the majority of them, right? Pretty basic, right? Not not a lot of narrative happening there. Um, Like... Pokemon games, too. Yeah, most of them are crazy basic, right? And, you know, Pokemon's only, like, the most popular video game ever. What's the story of Fortnite? Like. Yeah. Oh, God, Assassin's Creed. Assassin's Creed is terrible storytelling. <laughs> um. And, like, yeah, it's it's like, you know... You, you might say, like, you might say, like, oh, well, you shouldn't use, like, Fortnite or Pokemon as an example. It's like, no, I'm going to because they're incredibly popular games. And that controls, that controls the influence of, like, the gaming industry, right? People don't want to make narrative masterpieces in story making. They want to make the next Fortnite or the next Pokemon. Look at Pal World, right? That's what people want to make. Games are supposed to be fun. Absolutely. But games can tell... Um, 
James can tell really deep and meaningful stories. And as we talk about games in a form of being art, that is a part of the conversation, right? Mm -mm. Most recent Pokemon game had an extremely basic character twist in the end and people lost their entire minds because the formula is so well honed that a slight deviation stands out as an enormous amount. Yeah, that sounds about right. Games also want to be like Souls of Persona too. You're missing the point of what I'm saying. Like, games that are massively successful, people want to replicate that success. And most of the time, those games that are massively successful are not like narrative masterpieces. That's why a lot of games aren't very good at storytelling, because they're not trying to tell stories. Does that make the video game bad because it's not trying to tell a story? No, it doesn't, right? You can still enjoy Pokemon. It's still a fine game. Fortnite is a fine game. But when we talk about like video games and stories, that's why video games lag behind so much in this discussion of art in games, right? Also, games want to be like Persona is relatively recent as of P5, correct? Yeah, hot take. Souls is fucking awful at telling stories. I mean, I would probably agree with you, yeah. Like, there isn't storytelling in, like, Dark Souls, right? Yeah, this Elysium was fairly successful, but nobody wants to try and copy its success because it's too weird. Fucking Nier Automata is a fucking phenomenal game. Has a great story. But nobody wants to copy it because it's it's too hard, right? Mm -mm. Or like Undertale. Uh, to be fair, a few games did try to copy Undertale. Um, but Undertale, another great story, great, great narrative, right? Um, but again, a lot of people don't want to uh, replicate Undertale because it is gay or something like that. Right? There are games that have very good stories and are very artistic in how they do things. Uh, but most video games, the vast majority are very basic. I don't think Persona 4 uh, is not complex. I don't, I, or, sorry, I don't think Persona 4 is very complex. I think it's pretty basic. It falls into the kind of the majority camp, right? Um, yeah. So. You know, point being is, like, most video games don't have great stories. That's okay, because we play video games for a majority, like, for many reasons. But when I have, like, again, a degree in media, and I'm used to analyzing books and movies and things like that, a video game having a very basic narrative is pretty, pretty easy. It's not that hard, you know? When games like Grand Blue Ver- like, when Grand Blue, right- a gotcha game has more complex and interesting stories as a more complex and interesting overall narrative and interesting character and like more in-depth stories than most like triple a games again a gotcha game then like yeah okay <laughs> you, you, like you know what i mean like it, it's not gonna it, it's not terribly hard to see those trends once you get used to them It doesn't help that video games are extremely young as an artistic medium, correct? We're still figuring out how to tell stories of video games in ways that actually suit the medium well. Unlike TV, when it was young, video games don't have a nice predecessor medium, stage plays, and radio to act as a starting point. You are correct. You are absolutely correct. If you want to talk about the history of media, um, things like movies and and things like movies and television and even radio plays all had a basis in art in another medium which was plays, stage plays, right? Theater. Theater is where those things kind of came out of. So when people started making movies, even silent movies, even the very basic ones, right? They had an idea of what to do. And they made adjustments, and they made changes. Right? That better suited the medium over time. If you want an excellent example of an early film that came along and changed the gay co game completely, watch Citizen Kane. It's a great movie. It's a very good movie. It's one of my favorites, actually. Um, a little bit Nevik. Um, like, 
that that movie alone is an example of an early movie. Now I go watch the detail. Oh, I mean, I love the detail. That's that's one of my favorite movies too. It might be up. It's uh, it might be like my number one actually. Um, I just like it. But like Citizen Kane invented things, um, like different types of shots, different types of scenes, different like um, angles to shoot out, like rotary shots, things like that, right? Um. A story of how they had to hide the actual plot of Citizen, Citizen Kane from the studio was insane, for sure. Um, like, it revolutionized filmmaking and happened, what, like, 20, 30 years into filmmaking? Video games have only been around, especially as a medium of art, for about that amount of time, right? Um, so, like, yeah, it's, it's gonna take time. Medium story started by borrowing heavily from fantasy teacher RPGs and books, which are not mediums that generalize to video games as a whole. Correct. Yeah, pretty much. It's sort of a box tons of video, uh, tons of game stories live in. For sure. Yep. Live in our video games becoming a, u a ubiquitous art form. Mm hmm. Yep, for sure. So, like, you know, and, and that's why, like, I don't think it's terribly hard to guess the plot of a lot of video games, Persona 4 included. I don't think it's that terribly difficult. Because once you know what to look for, those patterns are kind of everywhere. That's also why getting, like, a degree in media kind of ruins everything, because, like, I can't watch bad movies anymore because it just, it's, like, painful. It's like just painful to watch because like you can see, you understand why things are bad or you can see like the flaws in things a lot more clearly. Um, that's definitely true for games too. You know. So, I don't know, it kind of sucks, but it's also kind of fun. Eh. The storytelling is trying to make it fit how video games uh, without the struggle of story beats having plot holes because of gameplay mechanics. Yeah, I mean, that's that's a part of it, too. You got to figure out how to get around that. So count you out for the Plan 9 watch along. What's Plan 9? Oh. What did you ask? Oh, right. She's got a crush on Ko. Sure. We've definitely hit the point where video games have had their Citizen Kane moment with few standout examples of games that use the medium well to tell an effective story, but it's going to take time to percolate out to the rest of the industry. Absolutely, I completely agree with you. But also look at movies, too. Like, just because movies are a well-respected art form doesn't mean that every movie is well-respected art, right? I can think of fucking like a hundred examples of movies that are just not great. You're always going to have those things, right? Mm, well. So did you ask him what kind of girl does he like? Nice girls. Nice? Is say anything about being cute, not even like a beautiful woman or anything like that. Alex almost panicked. But but every guy wants to be with a pretty girl, right? It's the good look good looking girls who find love, isn't it? Look at this, I'm tired of being around the bush. Just go ask him if he's got a crush on anyone. What are you waiting for? Go! You don't appear to have a choice. Better check downstairs. Yo. Oh, hey you. I gotta piss like a racehorse. Here, let me help you, Ko. <laughs> oh, you wanna know who I like? Uh, this is awkward. Um, maybe one more honest effort to get him to tell you. All right, but I'm only telling you this because I trust you, man. Don't tell anybody. Don't tell her. In fact, don't tell anybody. She ain't saw No! Uh, 
I find it funny how a video game that looks like a movie is said as a compliment, but a movie looking like a video game is used as a complaint. <laughs> Interesting, right? If you tell him Chia loves Yukiko, I will. Chia-san. Chia-san, damn it, are you happy now? Well, I'm at it. Uh, let me tell you, I'm a goddamn Justice see you next turn in class, you lucky bastard. See you later, I really gotta go. I like Chie because she reminds me of Daisuke. I like Chie because she's kind of like a guy. <laughs> oh my god. The presence of someone watching you. Seems I was eavesdropping. No! Hey, I... Girl, what's the point of those fences if people can just get around? Okay, relax. Hey, let's uh, let's talk about this. She has a G she has had a Naka, right? That frumpy girl? I, I got a beat out by that? I'm a hundred times better looking. Lost her composure. Pop her down before it gets any worse. Guys like pretty girls, don't they? I'm pretty now, and I had to work hard to become this way. If I can't be loved, then what's the point? I'll hear you out. Sob. Whew. to be fat and clumsy. My family was poor and everyone at school bullied me all the time. They used to surround me and say I was gross. They called me names like Piggy Hara. I had a crush and even told me not to look at him because I'd give him my germs. Those awful memories still haunt me in my nightmares. At the time I entered middle school, my family came, came into their money. Everyone got so jealous of us that we ran away, moved here. This is my chance to start over. It's time to show them all. Dieted, got into shape, read every fashion or women's magazine I could get my hands on, studied them like they were textbooks, and learned all the secrets, everything from attracting guys to smiling better. But... Uh, uh. <laughs> Looks like it was all for nothing. I couldn't be loved unless I became pretty, and now that I am, I still can't have it. I guess I'm doomed. I'll never be loved, will I? It's not like I have any other redeeming qualities. You're still young. You're so nice to me. I should have fallen in love with you. Already in a relationship with another girl. This is early. This is early. <laughs> Just kidding. This is. Hey. Why don't you and I just go out? Are you sure about that? You're a weird guy. I'm sorry. You're right, I'm sorry. I'm still a little confused. <clears throat> sure, Ray. I smile sadly. The relationship with I has grown deeper. No, that... That makes a lot of sense. God, that is early. Yeah, goddamn. No, that... 
That makes a lot of sense, though. So you can date Aya the earliest. You can date her the earliest if you kind of take advantage of her situation. Um, but then when you don't, she's like, what if we do? And you're kind of like, are you sure? And she's like, ah, no, not really. I'm just confused. I'm sorry. And she even apologizes to you. She actually doesn't like it if you try to get, really? She doesn't like it when you try. That's actually kind of based. That's really cool. I'm glad. Because, like, because trying to get with her here is, like, um, if I recall correctly, it breaks the link. That's, that's actually kind of based. Because it's I realizing that you're trying to take advantage of her in a vulnerable situation. And she goes, no, wait, fuck you. Which, based. That is very, very cool. That is very, very cool. That is very cool. It's like, yeah, don't take advantage of a woman in a vulnerable situation. Love that. That's fantastic. I'm going home now. Thank you. Thank you. I walked down the stairs with heavy footsteps. She decided to go home. Like... First of all, you guys made this joke already. Why am I so blue? Um, you guys made this joke already. How is Hanako and I in the same game? They are complete opposites. I's story is literally the story of like the struggles of um of growing up as a young girl, a teenage girl, and caving to the pressures of like beauty standards and like misogynistic outlooks on women and like sort of the societal like muck of trying to like well the societal muck of just being a girl right but that's what i's story is about and it's presented really well because it's like you learn that the way she's beautiful and bitchy because she has to be because she feels like the only way she gives people values by being beautiful, but she's not willing to be submissive enough because she's experienced real cruelty at people's hands. So she shoves people away and she's very mean because she don't, she uses that as a cover to stop herself from being taken advantage of. And then, like, it's Lani, even better. The social link grinding ho, Sammy o. I know that. And then it's even better that if you play this shit wrong and you clear the choose the, the you choose the clearly wrong answer of trying to take advantage of her, the game punishes you. Cause it should. It should punish you. Like, how is this in the same game as Hanako? Seriously, you guys sum that up really well. Oh. Like, I... I don't get it. <laughs> it it's, it's so... bizarre. How is it the same game as that hot spring, though? Mm -hmm. Like, I social link feels like it was written by a woman. And that woman was not allowed to write anything else. <laughs> Cause like that, that's, I mean, that's kind of beautiful. Just how she like, she like tells you that she just, she only feels this value of being like pretty and it drives her to doing something kind of drastic. And you can bring her down, not by trying to flirt with her, but by just being her friend. You bring her down and you help her by just being good to her. Like, 
Yeah, it's because she just needs a friend. She just She's lonely and she needs a friend. She doesn't need somebody to romance her. Oh god, I hate all the black shit in the air. This is terrible. She's literally so fucking lonely and a friend, a very much not a lover, is exactly what she needs from you. So when I watched stream the OG game for us in a replay through uh, through for them, I was really careful the iSocial link to show us their full arc. Really? Interesting. God, it's so hey. gross. Oh, morning, Yukun. Finally find time to fight the real culprit. Man, I'm so shocked to learn that it was a Dachi son. But I can never forget, uh, forgive what he said or what he's done. Win this battle? Uh huh. I won't lose either. He's worried about Nanako chan. You can't just let him do whatever he wants. Put an end to this for everyone's sake and for my own. That would be cool, Ray. I would like that. Like, hey, here's an idea. You can cheat. You can cheat on your. Uh, you can cheat on your girlfriend if you want in Persona Six. But if you do it, it breaks your social link. Does it eat? Or do you uh, not have time to hang out today? Decide later. See you later then. What do you do after school? <sighs> Fuzzy ones with polar bears, yeah. Polar bears. Is black though, letting them effectively observe the sun's rays. They're well content, have fur in the cold. Nice. Hmm. Hey, don't talk too much about P3 because we're going to be playing it very soon. But the mechanics of that sounds. Messed up. What the hell? They aren't white. Neat. I think I remember hearing that. Um. Ooh, do we hang out with Nanato? We should probably hang out with Nanato. Hello. Hey, you son. Both fairs and intentions. Rush minds every so often, let's become overwhelmed from exhaustion. Can we come closer soon? Yes, spend time yes. with Naoto. The man in black. It was definitely his like grandpa or something. I am Yakushiji, 
Secretary of the Shirogani Estate. Always the secretary. I humbly apologize for the other day. I must also apologize, though I may not have known. I involved you in this. It was an act put on by my grandpa. My master has been terribly saddened by Naoto-sama's state of affairs lately. Lacking acquaintances to confide in, she devotes every fiber of her being to work. My master wanted Naoto-sama to regain the joy she felt in days past. To regain the feelings when all that she wanted was to be a detective, regardless of her heritage or gender. <sighs> yeah, I think there's a name for people like that, Yakashiji. No, it was a gender detective. <laughs> What's in your pants? A spyglass? My mind goes back to the line that Naoto has where it's, oh man, I wish I could have been born as a man. I involved you at my own discretion, believing you to be trustworthy. Please forgive me. I received this from Yakushiji-san. It's the final challenge. I did what you can't stand to at a place you'd be fond of, but underneath rather than inside. A place I'd be fond of. Is it the table? Hmm. Give me some more hack because Naoto is small. Very short. No, people knew about transgender people. People knew about transgender people in 2009. Promise. Well, I don't hate them, but... If it has to do with my childhood, then it's probably somewhere high. It is somewhere high. Remember? I told you before that I made a secret base in the trees. The highest place around here is... The hill. Next, what I can't stand to do. There are several possibilities, but... Throwing things away? That's right! Did I mention that before? Considering what's at the hill, the most likely answer is the trash can. I have an inkling of what might be there. Let's go, senpai. Yes, I get it. The fog has enveloped the area. I forgot this thing even existed. It's the last of the seven tools. The detective's pocketbook. All the things I had forgotten about are packed in here. I think Grandpa wanted to remind me of them. Mm. That's kind of cute. Shame. He's selfish indeed. Forcing me to recall all this now. I was trying so hard. Not to be underestimated. Not to be condescended to. Come out and upset Naoto. If I solve this town's murder case, then everyone would accept me. They would acknowledge me as the fifth in the Shiragane lineage of detectives. You're so transgender. I told myself. I just wanted to be accepted. I wanted to be needed. That's why I fretted and stood on my tiptoes and focused only on solving the case. But the original reason I wanted to become a detective, it was because mysteries intrigued me. 
and I could help people by solving them. That's all. I remember now. Do you recall the time I faced myself in the TV world? It was my task to accept the self who yelled, I want a reason for me to stay. But my reason to stay was not solely to solve the crime. You, everyone, gave me a reason. You gave me a place to stay. Hmm. Naoto, you're so sweet. I have to be an adult. I have to be a man. With that way of thinking, I was running for myself. Oh no! <laughs> no! Wait! No, don't I think you're arriving at the wrong point! <laughs> to look for something to change or something to accomplish. I only need to have faith in myself. I finally think I can accept myself. That I'm a woman. Oh no! <laughs> to accept myself. I am a woman. No! <laughs> Wrong lesson! We were so close! It's for Soto. Why do you think they would handle queer issues well? Of course not. I mean, of course I didn't think they would. Um, It's funny. It's so funny. Because Naoto's giving up this, like, big speech. It's like this, this big speech. And it sounds like Naoto might be like, you know what? Maybe I can accept myself. I am a man. Like, I can be that. And then it's like, nope! <laughs> oh my god. Uh. Broke their ankles, yep. Nah, I, I didn't expect them to actually do this. Of course I didn't. I did kind of expect something like this, but because that it, it, it's so, like, the fact that it's so on the nose, and then just, yeah, <laughs> like, at the end, um, I mean, firstly, is transphobic. I'm gonna be honest. It, this is extremely transphobic. <laughs> um, Na Naoto, at best, is a caricature. <laughs> um, and I hate to say that, because I like Naoto as a character. I think Naoto's a cool character. Um, but this is transphobic. It just is. Like, it just is. Um, can you have a story of a character, uh, of a woman thinking like, oh, I have to be a man to kind of live in this world that I want to? Yes, you totally can have that, right? You can totally have a tomboy of a girl be like, I guess I'm a man because I like this guy stuff. And it's like, no, no, you can be a woman and like that guy stuff. You totally can. That's perfectly fine. But that's not what's happening here. And that's the argument that people are going to use against me when I call this transphobic, right? That's not what's happening here. Is that they are using transgender imagery. They're using transgender stories. They're using transgender narratives. They're using transgender terms and common thoughts transgender people have. They're using all of that, and they're going, nope, nope, nope. That's why it's transphobic. It's because of the way they've built this up. Um, it is textbook queer baiting. Um, but like, God, like worse, like worse. All honestly, like, like it's just because it's like, it's like next level queer baiting in a way. Where'd you put Naoto on the tier list? I mean, the social link is not good, and the main story treats Naoto like shit. I'm inclined to give Naoto their own tier, which is just called Baby I Am So Sorry. It is Baby I Am So Sorry tier. Because I struggle to call Na Naoto like a bad character, 
but it literally just feels like this character is a punching bag for like the writers. Same thing with Kanji. I mean, Kanji's great. Kan Kanji has a much better story. His story's a lot stronger because they actually let him go places. Where with Naoto, it just feels like it just, they put a screeching halt on the brakes of this character. Um, like, yeah, Naoto, you deserved better. For real, for real, for real. Like, I, I struggle to call, like, Naoto a failure of a character because also their, their role is as the smart. They're the smart guy, right? They're, they're the genius, right? They're the smart one. And they fulfill that role pretty well, honestly. They, they do succeed in that. Um, yeah, I really feel like the direct the director sat on the writers on both Naoto and Kanji's social links because the director was a chud who finally got kicked upstairs. Yes. Yes, I agree with you. Like, I, I, it does feel like that. It, 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 it does feel like... <laughs> she, no! It does feel like, uh, you know, there's probably a, a stinky higher up. Uh, but I'm going to be honest, as much as we like to rag on Hashino for it, we don't know that for certain, and I doubt it would have been just him. There were probably other executives and other high-ranking people that did not want Naoto to be transgender. Right? Um, so as much as we like to like point out one guy in particular, who we know is kind of not great, there's probably others. Mm-mm. Character assassination, I think. Great character concepts, just completely obliterated by queerphobic and misogynistic writing, for sure. But yeah, we're at a point where I can, I can pretty confidently just say Naoto is transphobic. Like the, like they, what they have done with Naoto is just very transphobic. Um, oh yeah, Nevik, I completely agree with you. I completely agree. But uh, yeah, um, anyone who disagrees with me, I'm gonna be honest, you're wrong. Don't disagree with me. Don't argue about this. You're just wrong. Like, there, there are very few things I will just kind of, like, put my foot down on, but this is a topic I can talk about and I have authority on. And if you don't, shut up. <clears throat> Anyways. <clears throat> Point being is, it's not that Naoto as a character being a woman or a tomboy and feeling, like, conflicted about that is bad. It's not that that is bad. It's that you use all of this trans stuff in Naruto as a character and then go whoopsie and, and, and then you just swerve right you swerve at it you you take advantage of these stories of these plights of these ideas of trans people you take advantage of that and you take that and then you use it to be transphobic essentially because like I would absolutely argue and I affirm that this is correct that like you can't take that stuff and then have a character who is maybe trans, but then at the last end of it is like, no, I'm not trans. Um, Cause that's, that's shitty as fuck. That is so fucking shitty. It is so mean spirited. Yeah. So I'm pretty confident in all, uh, all everything I'm saying, uh, especially with how just Naruto is treated uh, just in general. It's just mocked repeatedly over and over again. Like, I hear fans defend the writers all the time by saying Naruto is like Mulan, but I'm like Mulan has never felt uncomfortable being a woman and doesn't really, <laughs> and doesn't really appropriate trans language. Agreed. Yes. The simple act of cross-dressing is not transphobic. It's not inherently transphobic. If you make a mockery of it, then like yeah, it can be. Um, and like. You know, like, for real, like, it doesn't, the story of Mulan doesn't appropriate trans ideas or language or terms or things or feelings. <sighs> anyway. That I haven't yet become the detective I wanted to be. Sure, not I... Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> That's a real line. I am a woman and a detective. <laughs> Oh my god. Cool. I'm really glad I came to this town. 
It's where you and I live, and all the others, too. God, I just, uh, wow. Like, <laughs> no, don't ring time. JK, my man, Persona evolves. <laughs> uh, you know, it really sucks too, because, uh, it really does feel like Persona as a story. Uh, it really feels like Persona is, it can so easily include trans characters and queer characters in general. They fit in with the themes of Persona so well, but the game's so scared um, to just to just do anything, right? I wonder if they did that so you can date them, I assume. Oh, I mean, they totally made Naoto a woman so that you can date Naoto, for sure. Right? I just... It's just so... It's just so... I don't know what I know what I should do. It's just so weird. I mean, imagine Persona, but a, pa a pack of queer people trying to figure themselves out. Yeah, it's that'd be great. Like, that'd be really cool. <laughs> But, like, why would we do that? World peace will be achieved. Oh my god. Oh, nice. Everyone's saying it's because of poisonous fog. I don't worry about what's causing it. I have great news for you. Join a club called the Healing Club. We're going to teach us how to neutralize toxins in the fog. It's pretty popular in my area. I know a lot of people are in the club. Why don't you join too? Ask your brother to join the club. Can you tell me more about it? I don't worry about my health. I've been starting to feel ill recently. The club can cure me. That's pop. It must work. Uh. Imagine just P6 and the protag gender can be chosen. Look, honestly... I, I hope Persona 6 you can just choose your gender. That'd just be wouldn't that'd just be nice. Like at, at the barest minimum. That would just be nice. Hey, with curly hair, I'm having a hard time keeping their dues neat. Hair grows curly or straight. Um uh, cross section? Your shape is determined by whether it's going to be curly or straight as it grows. Your shape. Your hair is perfectly round, but curly hair is ovular triangular. The flatter the hair's cross section, the curlier the hair becomes. By the way, Miss Kashiwagi, so if you got curly hair, watch out for this fog. Is there correctly? Mm-hmm. Bye ball boys, bye ball boys. Oh, hey, how's your how's your crush going, girly? Changed her. I'm sorry, that's very tragic. Ooh. Mine have to be sports club. Or I could go to my daycare job. 
Now nah, we should we should probably focus on Sports Club because we might actually be able to finish the Ball Boys. There's like a realistic thing we could actually finish. Ball Boys. You did say nothing will stop me from MILF when you first met her. I mean, I do love me a MILF, but like... Look, I, I can recognize that we're probably not going to get eight social ranks in this time that's left, but I might be able to finish the ball mm. boys. Nice co here yet. Look at the gym, not the field, you know. I'm on the basketball team today. Right, they're here. It was about to start, Co. Huh? Huh? We don't have enough players. I see five of us right here. What's counting you? Look, I know you think that no matter how hard you train, you're not accomplishing anything. Can't do it all by yourself. You've got us. You've got the rest of the guys who showed up today. Don't forget that. That's great showing up for his BF. What a nice guy. What a nice boyfriend. The scrimmage begins. Dice guy's also probably really bad at it. Co skills are undeniable. Opposing team is passing well. It's a close game. You're playing your best today. Best is tenacious, and you managed to prevent an opposing team from scoring several times. Your diligence has increased. Nice. So good. But the score's tied. Two seconds left until the final buzzer. Opponent fakes out Daisuke and scores. Oh no, your team lost the game. Rats. <laughs> just on the... Just laying on the roof, just... <laughs> you came up here after the game? Fog has enveloped the air. I know! <sighs> you and I were in fire out there too. Damn, they crucified <laughs> I'm surprised that I won't name names, but we had one guy out there who didn't even know what traveling is. <laughs> how hard you train? You can't do it all by yourself. Is that how it went? <sighs> Name after dropping a pearl of wisdom like that. Aww. Shut up, damn it. Look, for the whole reason we set this up, Matt, this match was for. <laughs> <laughs> I know, it was all for me, right? Yeah, I feel better. I don't know how to say it, but I don't feel so alone anymore. Does that make sense? Looks up the sky. Well, you've been feeling bad for my parents. Took me in and raised me, hoping that I'd carry on the Ichijo name, you know? When Sachiko was born, and even if she can't carry on the name, she'll be the successor of the family. What does that make me? I'm not related by blood, so do I, I even have a purpose? There's no point in them even if you them even raising me anymore. Did I just leave? No, they've been really good to me. It's not me, it's, it's not them, it's me. And just because they're not your real parents that they're not your family? Is this family? That's a load of bull. This family, that's a load of bull. What do you mean? If we're gonna be family without being related, then why are we getting a tutor for the two-year-old? Why is it suddenly okay for me to play basketball? I can quit my lessons, I don't have to go to the social gatherings anymore, why would they tell me that stuff? It means they don't need me anymore, doesn't it? That I've been replaced, right? Sorry. So I know yelling at you guys won't solve anything. I'm gonna drop by the institute. Institute, you mean, yeah, the orphanage? Or maybe I'd ask about my real parents. I'll go with you if you want. No, no, that's okay. I don't want to drag you into this. I got it. If you need to do, then do it. I know you'll be back. Thanks, oh. man. By the game, when I heard that you set it up for me, it made me really happy. Thanks again, guys. Go laugh sheepishly. And your dice command but it was a success. You feel the relationship has grown stronger. Yay! 
<clears throat> or go with me, Co. They're letting you choose your own path. Ah, maybe they're being good parents. <laughs> Too bad we lost. Dude, shut up. We just gotta lose a battle to win the war, however that goes. Yeah, except we didn't win anything. See ya. But that's okay, I went home without... Uh, I was saying goodbye. He'll figure it out. He will. Spent time with Naoto. Uh, I'm gonna cry. Hello. Oh, it's thicker and thicker. Fuck you, Noto. Uh, do we do my tutoring job? When are we doing Margaret? Oh, we should do Margaret soon. Um, we should do that soon. Maybe, maybe we'll do that next. Actually, maybe we'll do we'll do her next. Uh, I don't know if I need. You know. be nice to see if Naoto was ready to rank up. But maybe I just do this just in case. Right? <sighs> Telling men feel what they do not understand. So they want easy answers. They'd rather be at peace than something they stay in the dark. Ironic in a way, but since people are murmuring about the fog being poisonous, the fog in fact is harmless, yet they feel calmer by treating it as a threat. Yeah, I can understand that. Yes. Oh, I agree. That was one is safe so long as one wears a gas mask. The town's peace is maintained. Mm hmm That's the place for the corporation. This matter of spreading accurate information to the town's people. One drop in the bucket, but it's better than doing nothing. Oh. For the time. Seems we've been chatting for quite a while. Please. A Tesla coil? Thanks, Naoto. Well then, let's go home. Naoto gives me a Tesla coil. Oh, I haven't seen what Tanaka's selling. He's selling gas masks. Good job, Sadaka. <laughs> Doomsday kits all sold out. God. What a biscuit. Um. So are I guess I mean here's a good question. Are the are the Margaret are the Margaret rank ups? Do they absorb a time slot? I don't think they do. Do they? What the fuck are you talking about, sir? Hmm. All these people are going insane. That's fun. Anyway, this shit's spooky. Gonna go into the place where it's not spooky. All right. A matador with the Mahama ability. Right, there's a death arcana, that's right. Card of death. That's just one side of life. One passive existence. 
almost die eventually. In their places new lives are born. One's soul's dying birth becomes the first gasp of a newly born life. All things that are, that are old and new, they will all die and be reborn again and again. Which these things will you hold on to? <laughs> you can barely contain my curiosity. Well then, I look forward to seeing what you can deliver. Matador with death. Or Hama. Matador with Hama. Death Arcana. Death Arcana, Matahama. Bana bana. You see how bad you get surrounded by piss. Imagine these folks. Hmm. True. Oh, so And ghoul. And mokai. Can you press right on the D-pad? I play on a keyboard, so no. Remember guys, controllers are for losers. This is real. Oh, does it move up and down? That's useful. Um, I don't know, it did that. I think you just don't have it. Uh, but there's probably some way for me to do a fusion to get it, I'm sure. Better or a special fusion? Great question. See that that's that's the stuff I need help with. Cause I'm never gonna be able to do this if I have to look if, if I have to fucking look at the most complicated um level twenty-four. Literally just saw Matador. Oh did you? Am I am I a goofball? Oh yeah, it's right there. Got him. Ah, I gotta go fuse shit now. Ugh. Okay, fine. Um Hunger. Yeah, it's all called hunger now. The fuck is that horse? Bahamut. You know, I guess Bahamut makes more sense for hunger than uh, Jester, huh? Yeah, okay, that kind of tracks. Judgment. I don't want to use my favorites. That's okay. Well, if he was a Nubis. Would you like to make a deal? Uh, yeah, I love deals. Mustard bomb? Damn. There we 
go. You're just playing Blue Mage. Real. Okay. Would you like to list the market request in their shortcuts? Beautiful, yes, thank you. That'd be fantastic. I want to do the social link, but I want I don't want to do a lot of work. <laughs> if I'm going to be honest, this shit sucks. Okay. Sammy hates the fusion ons. I I fucking hate it. I I really do think it's like the worst part. Um I do really think it's the worst part of this entire game. It just it just sucks. Um Okay, fuse to get a matador make sure principality's level 21. So I can get a principality. Okay, actually, let me see if I've got cards. I might have a card to make this easy. <clears throat> right, because I have to give skill cards. It's Hama, isn't it? I don't think I have it. <sighs> Alright, well, so now I gotta fuse. Anzu Herophant. I go talk to you later. This sucks. I don't want to do this. This just sucks, dude. Uh, I hate this shit. Anzu, right? I need an Anzu. Hierophant. No, wait, if I summon it, though, it's not going to be high enough to learn, right? <sighs> I, I, I hate, 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 hate so much. Oh, my God. As its primary system... I don't know, because, like, there's other things besides the fusion mechanics. Like, you cannot pretend. Like, the main draw of this game is the fusion mechanics. Like, you can't pretend that is the case. Because that is clearly not. Mm -mm. It is a part of the gameplay, sure, but, like, I don't want to engage with it at all. So I pretty much don't. Um, they lock story behind it, which sucks, because I want to do it. Uh, but they make it so complicated and obscure to unlock this stuff. It's like... Mm -mm. Like... It's just not... It's just, it's just not fun. Mm -mm. I mean, the P, yeah, P5 made stuff a lot easier. I just backed down and didn't even realize it backed up. Maybe I just skip this. I don't think this is worth it. This is going to take me hours. Mm -mm. And, like, I'm going to be honest. Anytime I hear people talk about Persona, it's not the fusion mechanics. 
That is not, I can't even remember it. Okay, so you got, uh, it's gotta be 19. Try to fuse an Anzu. Well, the problem is you need Anzu to be level 19. I don't know how to fuse the Anzu. So now what? <laughs> They just summon at level 15, it's not gonna do anything. It's Ish oh, there's Ishtar. Oh, Sabelle, too. I miss her. So I can't fuse it. So now what? <sighs> oh, I hate this. Okay. Oh, wow, I hate this. Yeah, no, I give up. <laughs> We're not doing it. I can't do it. I can't, I can't do it. Mm -mm. Like, I'm sorry, it's just too complicated. It's too complicated and I'm not willing to spend hours trying to figure it out and to figure the system out. Um, when I have to like, like use a calculator and then I click on the calculator and I get 10 trillion names. <laughs> like, I barely understand what I'm even looking at. I, I can't do it. I give up. I use the filter. It's too much. It's it's way too much. It is an absolute overwhelming amount of information. I click it on Zoo and it shows me a million lists. Even if I cl if I, even if I have to close and box them down, it's it's too much. It's way too much. It's too complicated. I'm not doing it. I'm not gonna spend hours trying to figure that shit out when I could just play the game. Sorry, Margaret, but like, it's it's too much. Spreadsheet simulator, fucking literally. Where is Kanji? Where is this guy? Like, look, some people are good at that stuff. Some people are not. Um, I am not. So it's it's just not worth doing. Asano's gone of course. Where the fuck is Kanji? I wish this place would look less horrifically awful. That'd be fun. What's with the children? I know, too. But. Yeah, but we're gonna skip like the whole game and I don't wanna do that. Where the hell is Kanji? Hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. school yeah i get i guess he's just not around then it's probably doing one of those things again where it's like is around but isn't around um well i guess the day's kind of a wash we can't do anything with it
Some people said you can hang out with Risei too, and she's also not hang outable. Yeah, she's like also not here, so I Yeah, I guess it's just kind of a wash. I think Marie had like an additional hangout thing. I might bug her about that. Let's go. Curious what it looks like. <clears throat> Juness, excellent. Fog hasn't felt the area, sure has. Fog again, it really bugs me. Enough of that. I don't know what's coming, huh? Mary was hoping to see the others. Yeah, I think you're incredible. I just got people around you smiling <laughs> everything. Spending all this time with you makes me feel like being with somebody is a normal thing Thanks. to do. So thank you. Making sense right now, am I? Whoa! <laughs> there you are, Kanji! Oh, cute. And of course you're with Yuki Kochi, eh? I'll play with any you have to call me too. Oh, why? Are you two while he was working? <laughs> Did I interrupt your date? Figure you guys were just hanging out here. Hmm. I just think of being a bit cold to the rest of us. We deserve to be invited too. It's going for Naoto. Damn, she and her roommate. <laughs> if you were gonna meet up, I might as well send everybody a text. I'm letting you hug Senpai all to yourself, real? Huh? Oh, this was something that you couldn't handle. Gee. It's not how it goes. It's something even I can handle. That's cute. It's nice to see everyone hanging out. Everyone, including Marie. Well, see ya. That's cute. Sure is nice to have a uh, you know the DLC girl interact with the characters. That is fun. Matter of Sumi's like was like this. I know. <laughs> uh, it's so. Yeah. Build a model? How do you even build a model? How do you even do that? What does it even mean? A uh, male... But how do you go from Marie to Kasumi? Well, people hate Marie! That's the problem, it's like, people fucking hate her. It's related to a fox quest? Oh. Mm. I guess I could try to do that at one point, but I couldn't find the person I got tired of looking. Yo. I haven't seen you in the morning in a while. Real bad. Having yeah, a cop in the case really surprised me, man. The more for us to wait, we have to go kick his ass. Are you still trying to get the dog to go home? I I think, but also like it's talking about somebody's friends. Is that the same? Is that the same thing? I don't know. I don't know. Like, I'm I'm too zoomer for such esoteric systems that like I that they that don't like that just like aren't intuitive. So I just don't interact with them. Naruto. Because I can try to try to see if the dog's still there, but I've interacted with it like a dozen times. But I didn't think that was the, the fox quest, was it? Yeah, I, I just keep doing this. Uh, 
Sick Rocket. Oh god, I don't even remember this. Um, was it Emmy Chan? Yuri? Yuri in my Persona 4? Uh, was it Mika? Mika Chan? It answered. Yeah, no, it's Okina. No, that's a different... I think that's a different quest. Is it? I don't know. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. I can't tell. <laughs> oh. I can do the daycare today. Huh. I think I'm rank four. Even Okina City is all fogged up. We're on Sticker Boy? Huh. The lady? No problem! Okay. I don't even know where the sticker boy is. Or anything from Tanaka. I have a lot of stickers, so maybe that would work. Let's max out Nanato right now, though. Yeah. Is a good idea. Feels like such a long time ago that we were here chasing after the phantom thief. <gasps> Joker? It was an unforgettable case, full of rewards. I enjoyed it. What about you? It was exciting. Yes, I thought so too. It was even more invigorating to solve it with you. I might be locked out. Eh. <laughs> Fine. I wanted to give you something today. I uh, made this. Please accept it. Oh, I detected that. That's cute. I haven't crafted anything like this in some time. If I went back to the estate, I could have added a camera and transceiver. Oh, but it flashes. I made myself one to match. Adorable. Now you're my assistant, senpai. Leave it to me. All right. You realize I'm quite serious about this, yes? Oh no. Oh no, that's sad the music. Love detective became a burden to me. I thought I had no other aspects apart from detective self. But you and the others gave me a reason to be as neither adult nor man. So, I was able to face myself as myself before the detective. By spending time with you all, I change day by day. It frightened me before, but now, with everyone, with you, I can proudly proclaim that I am myself. Nothing more, but nothing less. <clears throat> He's such a little guy. Big guy, Yamato Takeru. Takeru? This potential was still dormant within me. I wasn't considering the things that I should have. The people who care about me as well as my own self. When I'm with you, I feel fearless. And max rank. Fortune still seems odd for Nalato. 
I don't know how I feel about Wheel of Fortune for Naoto. Naoto, I am that. Let's have a shitty one bond. Shall be your eyes see the truth. Sound the ability to create Norn! The ultimate form of the Fortune Arcana. Love me a Norn. So now Toe's persona is a man. Gotcha. Cool. You now if you use Norn, the triple godhead of fate. Dun, dun, dun. That's cool. I like I like Norn's design. Very princely. Was a man that involves into a man. Yes. Ah, I see. <laughs> Um, no, I like it. I like, I like the way, uh, Yamato looks. Very cool. Very, very princely. I love the boots. Oh, Lord. Um... I think rate's pretty good, though. Yeah, sure, why not? Well then, let us begin. There's a lot you must learn before becoming a detective. I myself can't relent in my training. To become a former No, stop. <laughs> I don't even want to hear that. Your persona's a man Still now to like that may come in handy before too long. Shadowing a suspect. How oh, the basics of detective work into you. Nice. I'm a detective now. Look at me. Ah. <sighs> huh. Cool. Wait, yeah, no, I did finish Kanji. What am I thinking? I thought I still had him to do, but I finished him at like the very end of last stream, I think. Okay, so we have Yosuke, Fox, which probably isn't happening. Same thing with Margaret, probably not happening. Bell Athlete, Saki's brother, Milf. Uh, the tutored student and I. Bastard. Um, okay, I think we could probably finish Brolio. I think we could probably finish Brolioko, I. And I think Ball Boys. I think we might have the ability to do so. But. Yeah, you know what? Actually, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. I have to pee. So. We'll be back, we'll try to finish his confidence up, and maybe we'll get to the dungeon tonight. I'm kind of hoping we do. I'm trying to go as fast as I can, but we'll we'll see. Um, yeah, we'll see what goes on, but love you guys. I will be right back. One, two, three, BRP. Let's go. 
All right. Once more onto the breach. I am back. Hello. How are you guys? How's it going? Hopefully good. Hopefully you're not being consumed by the fog of another world. But you know, you never know. Doing good, hell yeah, Kaggle. That's bloggers. <clears throat> um... Will not become stronger yet with I. What? There's no way to hang out with her, though. Boo. This is so fucking annoying. I'm worried about not being able to see anymore. Only once I realize that only those right next to me can even see me. I got one thing if the teacher would see me in town, they'd stop and yell at me. They says fog. None of my teachers even know I was even five feet away. I kind of feel relieved because of the fog, too. People will get ill from it, but I'm alright so far. I said it might be the end of the world, you know? You might actually get to see it. I know, what's going to happen at the end of the world? I wonder. The body show it plays at night, nobody knows what's going to happen. I think the show has been kind of weird. At least it's entertaining. Any random shows that don't even show up in the programming guide. Haha, <laughs> what? <laughs> oh yeah, Tekken 8 came out. Looks pretty good. Probably not a fighting game I'm gonna get anytime soon, though. Though it does look fun. Right. Tekken doesn't seem my style of fighting game. Plus, I'm really into, like, Graham Blue right now. Been playing that a lot. But uh Titan looks really cool. It's super pretty too. It's a gorgeous game. I don't have a hanged man. Alright, I'll be back. Eat a lot. I feel like all of our so our scenes happen here. Sorry about last time how I kept talking about all that nonsense. I wanted to apologize for that. Never mind. It's so strange. You don't distance yourself from me like everyone else. You preach to me like you know everything. <laughs> feel comfortable around you. That's good now, okay? You should feel comfortable around your friends. You know, I like cream puffs. I know it's kind of girlish. Let's go to cream puff shop by our house. So everyone's while I'll buy some and take them home. Put them in the fridge. Sis would eat them. If I put them in the fridge, just would eat them. Make some kind of lame excuse like, I ate them for you since they were about to expire. In the world from <laughs> Save the world from Xana works up a lot of hunger. True! So we're always getting fights over cream puffs. Now the cream puffs don't disappear. I bought some. They expired in the fridge. When I saw that, I thought, oh, maybe, maybe Sis isn't here anymore, you know? So I threw them away. I told you before, if you ask me if I hate the killer, the answer is no. 
Truth is, it's not even a no. I don't know anything. I have a meaningless daily life. Just confused parents in a dark house. Just, just rotting cream puffs. How do I get away from that? Would it be best for me, for sis? I, I just don't know. Take your time. The more I wait, the more time goes by, and the older I'll be before sis... I'll be older than sis before I figure anything out. That would be good. Okay, well, I guess that was the wrong answer. I know I'm stagnating. I know it's not good. I know that I need to move. I know, I know all that. I listen to Aoko's worries. So you're able to support him. I hope so. Damn, Persona 4, you get two social links that are really good and, and have the... Uh, essentially boiled down essence of di of understanding different paths through the grief and the loss of a loved one. Because there's two social links that do this. And they're both really good. Come to think of it, sometimes Sis would bring cream puffs back from her job at Juness. She would eat them and complain that Juness brand tasted bad. This looked like she was having a hard time working at Juness. But she said it would eventually be for the sake of this our store play around but sometimes she acted like the eldest sibling it always irked me um and next time will you go to Juness with me i'd like to check it out Juness, i'll talk to you next time uh, but i love Juness. i can work as a tutor today yay Hooray for me! The fog is everywhere. That's what's gonna keep freaking telling me. Come on. Oh, I can spend time with I? Hell yeah. I was just complaining about that, and God heard my answer. <laughs> do I have... Do I still have Andre? Andra? Not Andre. Mashup of Persona 4 and Curse of Strahd. Oh my God. You know a series developed by Fog? You know, I've heard of it. Do you, you? This Fog is insane, isn't it? That's an Okina. It's totally clear. Then I come back here and I can't see a thing. Actually, Okina is foggy. And I want to think about this. Mind helping me out by chatting a bit? Playing with her likes might be a good idea. Yeah. <laughs> well, of course you do. You're being asked by me, after all. I love her. She's such a hoot. Y you know... I was saying this fog is poison gas, but it can't be true or we'd all be dead, right? My parents bought gas masks. They told me to wear one to school. My makeup would get ruined, and it's so ugly. I said I didn't want to wear it. Plus, kids wearing gas masks? Creepy. Fog is getting thicker and thicker. Aren't you worried at all? Huh. In fact, I'm excited. Eh, a little. I yeah, see. That's why I figured. Maybe you won't make it into being a big deal, but you can't just ignore the situation either. I seems worried. Hey, Janessa's going to start selling gas masks. Sure knows how to do business. Those guys are sharp. Like a curse, this used to not be covered in snow. The city used to not be covered in fog. Uh, oh, time sure passes quickly when I'm with you. Yeah, this is a little something for you. Here. Soul food, nice. It's not much, but it's a thought that counts, right? Well, let's go. See you again. Have you noticed that guns won't work on the insolent cavalry man? So you should save your ammo. <laughs> oh my God, no. <laughs> We can do this. Bye, oh. boss. We ran into each other quite a bit, haven't we? Do you remember what Adachi said? Disappeared in the fog by the end of the year. We've seen kidnapped, but we still need to be conscious of our time limit. It's important to be ready for what lies ahead, but we should hurry. You're right. And the lives of the main counter are at stake. There's no longer a any level of a murder investigation. We have to make sure we stop him, no matter what. It was a very common line in P5. Yeah, yeah. I know, Key. 
Your son. Are you free after school today? Uh, decide later. <laughs> well, maybe some other time. He's immune to gun every single turn. For real? Hi, hi. <laughs> Fancy meeting you here. Hey, if you did, you want to hang out? Uh, sure. Okay, see you later then. Hey, why the music change? Classroom is in an uproar. Did you hear? The fog made someone faint. I heard it was someone from 3 3. I don't know what really caused it, right? No point in panicking. We're about getting a gas mask. If you didn't have one, you could be next. Hey, be quiet, everyone. Class is still in session. No talking. Or continues. That was horrible music. Hated that. Where are we? On top of the water tower. Okay, fair enough. Call the eye up there. Fog has developed. The fog sure has. I'm sorry. I don't mean to keep making you hang out with me. I don't mind. Thanks, you. You really are a nice guy. If I calm down and give my life some serious thought. Why do we in such crazy shopping sprees? Why do we feel the need to be so well dressed all the time? What makes me want to ditch class? Do I want people do I want to stand out so that I'll catch people's eyes? Why do I always find myself wanting to talk with you? I said if I couldn't be pretty, I'd be better off dead. Nobody likes people who aren't pretty. They hate you. What's the point of life if everyone hates you? Lately I've been thinking, maybe I'm wrong. There's a lot going on, I don't know. I guess I just shouldn't be jumping to any conclusions. Before I realized it, I was crying. I always made sure not to cry, too, because it makes my eyes swell. Pulled back my curtains and the sun was just coming up. Stars were shining so dimly. For some reason, it made me think of you. I wonder why. Yeah, because we're friends. <laughs> I have a lot of male acquaintances, but you're probably the first one I can call a real friend. Aw, shucks. I smile happily. Aw. You're a weird guy, you. I'm glad we met. That's cute. I love I. She's a hoot. Let's go home, huh? If they catch you with me, you'll probably get all the extra lectures, too. Let's split here. Mm -mm. You're the first guy to not try, not trying to get into my pants. You're a weird guy, you. How you're very nice to me. <laughs> like, oh, poor I. Nato, 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 nato. Fortune shrine, nato. Nato. For a split second, I thought Nato was like a dachi just standing there. I'm like, oh. The Dutchie's like... God of death or some shit. Remember that weird, like, spooky part of the, like, the beginning of the game where you're fighting the mysterious figure in the fog? I remember that. That was pretty spooky. Not gonna lie. I'm not just stay there. Why, wondering why the hell you haven't finished this dungeon yet? Well, sorry. Look, I'm I'm trying to finish a couple social links. I really want to finish. Okay, okay, Adachi. I saw on the midnight channel countless black creatures crawl out of the fog and infest the town. I was overrun by them, and then people who inhaled the fog turned into them too, and. The last person that appeared looked just like me. What should I do? I don't feel good. People turning into monsters? That sounds awesome. It's like some kind of anime. Whenever it feels to turn into a monster. Huh? How it feels? Oh, I guess everyone was turning into monsters. That'd be okay. If everyone's becoming a creature, why should I worry about becoming one? 
Uh, just be like, we're evolving into another species. Yeah, guys, that's normal. Uh, monster high school arc. Become creature. Aye, aye. Uh, sure, why not? Is this I Am Legend? Fog has enveloped the area. Fog has enveloped the area. <laughs> God! How much do you want to bet a Dachi turns physically, uh, turns into a monster? Oh, the cash money. I have some news for you. The other day I bumped into him and we talked for a while. You know, Kokun. But nothing happened. My heart didn't race. He was just a normal good guy. I guess I felt I was this kind of a feed. I felt what, what I felt was kind of a fleeting thing. Yeah. Happens all the time. I mean, like falling in love with the idea of being in love. <laughs> Never thought that would happen to me. I guess I was wearing my heart on my sleeve, huh? I was lying to myself. There, there's been two ways I could go. I always did what the ideal girl would do. I forgot about the real me. Rumi likes bulldogs more than German shepherds. Oh, really? Okay. Better long distance running than sprints. I prefer milk over tea. And I like dafu, uh, dafuku more than cream puffs. I don't know how to hook up a TV. I think aromatherapy smells bad. And any purse that, and any purse that will carry stuff is fine. Oh, that's cute. I hid that part of me away. I just pretended it wasn't there. I am all for I getting a bulldog. Just like, just like, just like this like really like chumby bulldog that she loves to death. That's cute. When I didn't think anyone would like me, of course I didn't have any redeeming qualities. I wasn't me. That's why right now I feel pretty good. I will support I in her time of need. Hell yeah. Today's forecast dark. It dark outside. Oh, it's already getting dark. I guess it's true. Time really does fly when you're having fun. Bye bye, you. I'll see you later. See. You. Today's forecast fog will envelop the area. That wouldn't do that. That would probably solve the fog. And funkin' windy. The fog is here. The fog is. Here. The fog is coming. The fog is coming. The fog is coming. If I resay, uh, oh, I've got the tutoring job. Time to go a tootin'. Persona 4 is a Stephen King novel. Will it ever, will my relationship ever deep it, deepen with this bitch? The fog is coming. And Leon's getting larger. The fog is coming, the fog is coming. The 22nd is the best day to do the dungeon, right? Good morning. Oh, I reset. This is gonna be the final battle, finally, huh? But I think about when I made the decision to come here. <laughs> I came thinking I could find myself a piece of quiet in a little country town. But I have no regrets. So glad I met you. Yeah, me too. We can't lose that Adachi. Let's beat him and bring him to justice. I'll do my best to help you until the very end. Let's win and give Nanako Chan something to smile about. Reese is so sweet. Reese even has puffy hair. I love Reese. She's such she's she's great. Why is the fog yellowy? It's all the piss in the fog. The fog piss. Uh, I'll decide later. I think I got Naoki to hang out with. And the ball boys. So we're gonna vary things up a little bit, I. But don't worry. Oh, classroom is enough for- I hate this music! 
Well, I guess my cup was it? Oh, my parents bought for me. Whatever, I'm safe now. Check it out. I heard if you catch a cold, it's easy. You got a higher chance of getting sick from the fog. Seriously, oh my god. Oh my... Shut up. No talking. You're still in class. She's gonna get covered in fog every 50 years. Don't worry about it. TV said anyway, so let's get down to business, can't we? I don't like it. This is Bicentennial Piss Fog. Don't worry about it. We all have our Bicentennial Piss Fogs. You know, what happens. Spent with I. Okay, let's go. Ant with Naoki. rushing to get these two done. Mm -mm. Yeah. Well, uh, come with me to Junus. Sad time. You just finished walking around the hall of Junus? Fog has enveloped the area. We just our apartment downstairs was incredible. So many kinds of liquor, the price is much lower than ours. There's no way we could win. We're doing well, but we've been doing well lately. If it's just murder, there are some people who buy from us out of pity. Ironic, isn't it? I'm not trying to be kind. <sighs> Better than selling nothing, so I don't mind. But it's over for us. Our family's in shambles. My parents won't even speak a word about Sis. I says she never existed. Then at night, they cry. I do. Hey! You? Oh, it's Yosuke. Oh, aren't you Saki Senpai's... Oh, hi. This, this is the first time I've been to Junus. I don't really have anything to do with the store. I just don't hold any grudges against you, but... It's just that my parents and the neighbors would have said something. So I never bothered. <laughs> uh, we're in the same boat, buddy. I see. Probably huge, huh? Well, just looking at all the food here. It's like its own country. Yeah, your sister said that too. I was sad. I know what I can right now for my sake and your sister's. You just sit there crying, it'll be in it'll just trouble in her, you know? I'm not crying. Alright! Today's grilled steak day. I'll go grab three. Oh you? You'll have to pay for your own. This case I'm sure is nosy. Oh wait, so are you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be lumping in <laughs> lump me in with him. I can't just ignore you. Am I that pitiable? No, it's not it. It's different with you. You're not being kind to me because of that. I'm sorry. Sorry. I'm just glad I saw where my sis worked. I could never have come here by myself. I don't think I'd even thought about it. Thank you. And I'm sorry, Noki. You are... You are in a rough state, my friend. Is it good? It's awful. <laughs> then you're okay. Silently continues to eat. I say warmly watching over him. Ah. I'll see you again. Back to his house and went home. Yippee! And Yosuke is such a better person when there are women around to harass. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Uh, yeah, that's Yosuke. I love how there's all this black stuff floating in the around the air, floating around in the air, because that's normal. You're scared, I'm scared.
This club won't be able to meet today either. I used to think the school without clubs is worthless, but I'm getting used to life without any clubs. I'm actually kind of relieved. It's the less thing for me to worry about. Please don't leave, Fog. Stick around for a while. Totally agree with you, Senpai. The fog is so thick that I don't have to worry about how people react to what I say. I can't see them and I can just assume the reaction for whatever I wanted so I can say anything I want. <laughs> what the hell, guys? Yeah, you're right. If you don't see other people, you're kind of stuck caring about them, right? Same goes for me. I used to worry about how much others so much before, but now, psh, just to just look out for number one. Never felt this way before, but it's not bad at all. What the fuck? <laughs> people are going to start, like, getting involved in violent crime. <laughs> True danger of the fog. Object permanence. Real. Foggy skies isn't as bad as I thought it'd be. Fog makes you twisted. Besides, some, sometimes it's not nice, but visibility is horrible. You don't have to make eye contact with anyone. You know, I'm starting to like the foggy weather. Why is everyone just like... Uh, compassion is not for the good of others. Hey, Ikuna was helping. Passion makes you look better. Here's Sato-chan, rather. No, Arakumi uh, chan for taking compassion on her. Doesn't mean, why does compassion benefit yourself? Because it's when you show compassion, that others will show compassion to you in turn. So you should be kind to everyone. People often think that compassion is a weakness or a crutch, but that's not true. So you know, I was asking. Thanks, Yukun. Yay! Expression and chie! Yay! Fog that makes you twisted. Don't worry, if you guys get sick from the fog, I will uh, nurse you back to health in a silly little nurse outfit. Those are ball boys. I is not here. Let's see if Naoki is. Naoki Yosuke, take care job. Okay, nope. So it's ball boy. Ball boys it is then. Okay. Oh, jeez. Hopefully. Am I gonna have enough time to finish them? Oh, well, I hope so. I don't think I'm gonna finish the ball boys in time, but I might. Yo. Oh, it's not ready to advance yet? Uh, that's not good. Well? Are there other things to be doing? I guess I could hang out with you. Yeah, I could hang out with Yosuke. I could do the daycare. Hmm. I'm actually gonna hang out with Yosuke. You know, maybe I will. I need to get me another persona though. Yosuke and daycare are the only social links available today. Hmm. You know what? No. I should do the daycare. Why not? I do have a temperance. Yeah, why not? Let's play with the kids in the fog. I remember, Phoenix, Ranger, Featherman, R, you suck. How dare you dare you say that again? You're just gonna get us. Run, everyone. No chase his friends it. As his face turns red once again, the children tug at you from all directions. Yay, understanding. Yukon, let's go home. It's getting late. 
Akio, we're going home. When is he coming back? Huh? Hmm? You mean your father? Hmm. I don't know yet. Going home with Ryu Kun. Hmm. Uh, guess he wants to see his father. <sighs> Probably. Maybe if he goes home, he'll be alone with me, right? <laughs> There's a stranger who barged into his life six months ago, so I feel a bit sorry for him. Yeah, but you're, like, so pretty, though. This one kind of set me up. Told me he had a child right before we got married. Divorce his ass? I'm sorry, what?! I thought he was the one for me, so I figured the three of us would be able to work it all out. How do you hide that? Right after we got married, he was sent to China on business. He's been in contact with me, but he doesn't change the fact that he's not here. So inconsiderate. Hmm. Do you love Yuta? Huh? huh? Uh, of course I do. Yeah, there's no way a child can get along with a new mother, right? So it can't be helped. We rushed into a marriage too quickly. Tell me I wouldn't have to work. I thought it'd be a good idea, but... <laughs> oh, don't tell my husband, okay? Can't tell if it's genuine. Huh. Well, make more progress on the MILF. Look at that. <laughs> Interesting. Very interesting. What have you just home by now? Where'd be going now to? It was nice seeing you. Interesting, Airy. Interesting. I sure can work as a tutor today. Divorce him, get custody for real, for real. Hi, Nato. They're really making sure I get a chance to chill with you, huh? Not like Ko or anybody out here, is there? Oh, there's you, Saki Konishi's brother. Oh. Yes. We're gonna spend time with him just in case. Just so we can try to finish this. Hmm. After today, there's no customers. Good timing, though. My parents work too much. Extra hard to try and forget. Pains me to see them like that. Are you with the fog to continue? Hmm. No way, I don't want the shop to go to business. I just think they need a small break. Fog isn't bad for just us. I heard the lady at Shiroko. Oh, sorry. Become stronger soon. Excellent. Thank you. Have time to take off. Thanks for hanging out with me. Oh, these are pretty good. You should give it a try. Yes. You gave me magic? Damn. Don't you love it when your friend gives you literal magic? That's pretty cool. So you defeat the threat at all costs. Right, okay, it's the same thing. Like close up magic? Apparently. Hello, Kimti. Sano, Hasano, Kanji, Kanji, uh. I'm not sure it's anybody I want to hang out with. Well, that's not good. Well, shit. Yeah, I might not be able to... Everyone available, you have at rank 10 already? Yep. Might not be able to get both of them. 
Fog is even chunkier now? Yeah. And they're not even around, so I can just, like, burn a time slot and just, like, yapping at them. Can't even do that. Um... It's like Yosuke's there. So like Risei and Kanji aren't like around. Well? And, oh, wrong place. Yeah, I mean, I guess I could try that. I don't think I can even do the fortune box right now, so. Oh, movies can wait until after Adachi's been caught. Okay. Never mind. This is where I wanted to go. What am I doing? Um... Finally home. Phew. Welcome home. Uh, I don't know. Oh, what's this? GA, by GA. How is your new work, Bones? Oh no, I can, actually. That's nice, at least. Oh, wait. No, I should do male classmates. Yeah, I should do that. Terribly boring! Sorry about that. <laughs> well, sorry, man. Oh, well. Oh, well. I mean, Yukiko, you can hang out so much at night. I wish other people were like you. Just in case, with I. Just in case. I know I can hang out with her, but like, just in case. Stacking it for the next two. Hmm. Alright. We're coming up on that last day. Yo! I think the year's almost over. It's like it's been so long, but so short at the same time, you know? The way people in town have been acting lately is no joke anymore. Come so far, we discovered the real killer ourselves, and all that's left is the final showdown. We gotta get that bastard dodging no matter what. I have a feeling that this town will be back to normal once we do. Let's make sure we win this. I'm counting on you, leader. Count on me for anything. If you and everyone else is with me, you can. I'm unstoppable. Hell yeah. Oh. Uh. I hate these scenes. I know it's to put pressure on you, but I hate these scenes. I would do that. Either that. Either way, that's crazy. For real. Just ill from the fog. You should make assumptions that evidence not to mention fog induced illness is painful. You know that. Turn up from is ill from the fog. The other teachers told me. Roar only grows louder. Ugh. Sorry, my dude. Uh, 
Oh, it's just him and not her, is it? Oh, that sucks. Okay, well. Still might have a chance, we'll see. Mm -mm. I think we are gonna get to the dungeon though tonight. Probably not all the way through it though. Not that surprised. I thought this might take way too long. Also, there's some event stuff that kind of tripped us up. There's a place I wanted to go to with you. Oh, where they found her body. Fog has enveloped the area. This is it, where they found Sis. All time I could never bring myself to pass through here. I was afraid of remembering Sis and thinking about how, how her body ended up. Oh, I feel like I can finally accept the truth. You know how it is with TV dramas? People cry for days on end and their sad memories come back to torment them. It wasn't even like that for me. It was the same as ever. But I thought, I thought I was a cold human being. Maybe... He was able to cry to look like the actors did on TV. I thought that maybe I didn't actually like Sis. Hmm. Yeah, people are just different. Yeah. You're right. Because I'm not like a character on TV doesn't mean I'm wrong or strange. Talking with you little by little. Started to understand that. Just try not to think about Sis. It's for me to tell myself this cold person and to think about sis and suffer turning away from the pain i've let myself think about her she must have wanted to live more huh it's a voice line oh god i don't know what to say here uh, for her sake all right that's the only thing i can do for her now finally let go and started crying <laughs> I wanted her to live more. I wanted her to live. I was biting his lip. Uh, just let it all out now. Trying for the first time. Uh -huh. Crying and hiccuping. Thank you. Finally, finally feel that I'm sad. Release the profound sadness that he had buried. As your relationship with Naoki has grown stronger. This is sad. <laughs> He's a good social link, though. I'll give him that. Your son, let's go home. I'm gonna talk about my parents, with, about Sis, about me. I'll see you again. I went home. Fortune, resay, fortune, resay. Resay, fortune, resay. Uh. Should probably do a fortune. Just to maximize my time. Hi, Kanji. Hi, Kanji. He has a name, too. They do him so dirty. Okay, we'll become stronger soon. That's good to know. And then 20. Oh, more students talking great. Head hurts from the flowers because of the TV or... Oh, what's the matter, Senpai? You look gloomier than usual. I'm a classmate that studied all night again. Also studying too, I can't slack off. That's the teacher said if I can't solve all the problems with the study guide, the entrance exam should be easy. So by the world is ending soon. I can't believe you haven't heard about it yet. Everyone's talking about it. The entrance exam is useless. My head, it's so seriously killing me. What if it's from the fog? Well, if it is, the fog's not going away, so neither will my headache. Oh my god. These guys, these hooligans. I want to talk. 
I want to talk to I. My friend. All right. Hey, Bob Boys. Sorry, Bob Boys. Oh, she's not here. Well, that sucks. My friend, my enemy? Something like that. I may not end up finishing her, which is a shame because she's the one I wanted to finish the most. <laughs> um, That sucks. That actually genuinely really fucking sucks. I... Yep. I wanted to finish her, but I guess I don't get to because for three days in a row she didn't appear, so... <sighs> yes. Awesome. There was this here once a long time ago. It's pretty agile, so she crossed the river by jumping from rock to rock. Scared, so I watched her from the side and just waved at me and disappeared into the grove over there. I cried like hell. I was crying, just crossed the bridge without me noticing and yelled right behind me. Is my pants. <laughs> Lately, that's all I've been remembering. It's the same way now. Is the river separating us? This is gone and I'm still here. Cross over the other bank, but I'm still in this one. I don't know how much I cry or piss my pants. I know she isn't coming back. I've been trying not to think about it all this time. But I finally feel like I can face reality. That's all thanks to you. Hmm. Doesn't do anything. No. You did everything. You talked to me. You listened to me. I, I thought there was no point in my existence. I was really happy to find out there's somebody out there who would actually devote time to me. I was able to do this here. Check it out. Juness receipt. A normal receipt. It's not just a normal receipt to me. It's not a normal purchase like it would be for someone else. I wanted to give it to you. Smiling cheerfully. Naoki has formed a tight bond. Go check out the 100% guy that structure on I's wonky schedule because she's the most irregular one. Really? Guess that makes sense. You create Addis, the ultimate form of the Hanged Man Arcana. <laughs> uh, you know, some part of me feels bad uh, that I maybe should have tried to, like, rank up, uh, tried to rank up Yosuke to finish him. But, eh, I don't really care. God of Sacrifice, Attis. Now the store will stay at school though, so it'll only be after school and on holidays. Plus our family is yet to really accept Sis's death. They only need to bond and working at the store is the first step we can take towards uniting the family. Yusan, please come visit our store. Are you so successful you think Juness who? I was completely free of worry. I get another chance to talk this much. Oh. Um, That's cute. I really want to thank you. For the rest of the day with Naoki. He's a good boy. I like him. Oh, hey, I. There you are. Uh, still not gonna count, but might as well. I got a job at Square Enix. Oh, well. Insane, isn't it?
Well, at the very least. Okay, if schedule, she just like me for real, for real. Huh? Here. Ooh, plum candy. Her laugh is adorable. She is cute. Silly Mill, hopefully something you can use. Is that you can walk me home. See you again. Head back to your home. All right. She's great. Yo. No, you morning. It hasn't been getting lighter. I realize that winter solstice is tomorrow. Longest night of the year. The 22nd is the longest night of the year because it's the winter solstice and it's the best day to go into the... That's actually kind of cool. You know what? That's actually kind of a nice touch. But after that, it'll only get lighter. Turns back to weirder and weirder, especially if the school seems funky. Whatever Dachi said is true, we'll be saving him the whole town when we beat him. Much time left until the end of the year. Let's finish this. Yeah. Yeah, I'm glad we were you were our leader. Counting you. Lead us to the very end. Let's do this. I must consider that we're all going to die. Oh. Like the Egyptian royals. Yes, I'm sure. Yep. You're really weird about it. My name Cleopatra. As the one who is known for being the three most beautiful women in the world. Uh, yeah. He's like, you know a thing or two about beautiful women? Apparently. There's more than one Cleopatra. Well, tell me if you know the answer. The seventh? Looks like it. Yeah, the seventh. Cleopatra the seventh is always kind of amongst the ranks of the world's most great beauties. Ever since the other Cleopatras are also royal queens, I'm sure they were each beautiful in their own ways. I had a feeling you would. Thanks. There's some new rumor going on about me. You know, I could probably just steamroll Yosuke's, like, confidant if I got the chance, but, like... <sighs> oh, well. Alright, look, there he is. Aye, there she is. Alright. Well, that's one more at least. Almost done. Oh. Sure. Okay. Alex almost happy. Nice. Welcome to the station with I. Hell yeah. Some else has approached I. Oh, hey, Chan. I heard what you up to a while. What's up with that? Eh. Gonna play hard to get to now? I see how it is. I gotta hear about your new arm candy that transfers through to you, right? This is like dating that loser? You standing right behind him! Oh my god, just. menacingly. We're not dating. Don't talk about him like that. Who fool me? Hey, I'm not that worried or anything. I mean, come on. Me versus him, not even a contest. Could show you stuff you'd never even dreamed of, babe. Uh -huh. Stop it, Jesus. Nothing going on between you and me. Never has been. So much for... Oh, gross. Uh -huh. Forget it. I'm not going anywhere with you. Hey, hey, what the hell? You had a wrap around your little finger. And now you're going to act like this? You're really mark on that... Precious face of yours. I'll call up some fre Oh, wow. That's, uh, vile. Huh? I care about your stupid threats. Why don't you just do it already? Things look good. You feel like I is in danger? Uh, I'm gonna help her. You decide to help her. Like, what are you trying to be your knight in shiny armor? Didn't know you were getting played, dumbass. Usually pissed at you, little shit. I was struck. You got what you deserved. How? Ah, sorry, was that unnecessary? Huh. So if you run in front of her, she runs in front of you.
Uh, you're a cool lady. I like you. Scene was a little much, though, if I'm gonna be honest. But yeah. Thank you. Haha. <laughs> laughing to hide her embarrassment. Uh, don't worry about it. I just thought maybe I could do something to help you for once. I guess I didn't really think that far ahead. It was kind of like a reflex. My face is gonna get all swollen. Uh, oh well. I was laughing, despite her swollen cheek. Your ship with eyes gotten stronger. She is pretty. That is actually kind of cool. That like, if you go to step in front of her, she steps in front of. She just does it back to you. Let's go somewhere close by. I don't want anyone to notice. Even with a face like this, I still want to be with you. See you again. I had school and part ways after walking her home. Hmm. She's also a good moon when you think about it too, because she's like so full of lies in a way, right? She like obstificates like herself so much. And I don't know, she's just really like I's just really cool. I just really like her. <laughs> like she's she's really cool. She's probably one of my favorites in the game, actually. She might be my favorite. Even. I just think she's neat. Yeah, she's just legit really cool. Better than Risei? Ah, uh, hmm. I don't know. I really like Risei, too. Maybe like in a complicated girl? Who would have guessed? Eh. Yeah, got me. Silver rank 10 to stab you in the heart. True. We'll see. No, I mean, she, she seems like a... She's just a really good character. I love her and Risei both. They're amongst my favorites. Complicated girls and emotional loner guys. We love to see it, baby. All right, 22. Three students talking. Dungeon time. Finally time for the dungeon. Once again, I can't see your face. This fog is really liberating. Can you imagine how I used to live before the fog came? Back then I used to be cautious when I said others, but not anymore. W what, did you say something? Come on, don't make me waste my breath. Does your head still hurt? Anyway, don't worry about it. The fog is still covering everything. Another day of glorious weather. I heard on the TV that the world was about to end. I wonder if what will destroy the world. I'm getting excited. I can't wait for it to happen. Ah! All right. Hi, Tadal. Wait, no. Don't let this be. No! Are you sure I have to do it on the 22nd? Are you free today? Are you sure? <laughs> oh, I have to, don't I? Another. The TV will tell us what to do. They don't get the Christmas event if you do it any later than now. Ugh. Between I and a Christmas date with Risei? No! Ugh. Fine. I'll go to the dungeons. I want my Christmas date. I'm so sorry, I. Uh, Reese Hoobus is literally your girlfriend, as a reminder. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. <laughs> Q has to be like, literally your girlfriend, by the way. 
I was just so close. So close to greatness. Is it just because he could? I'm a time he could the first to death, so people on two things they would say with the killer. The doctor made it sound like it was just an amusing coincidence. Shelter and the TV and all that crap. Fill everything in the shadow so you can watch and enjoy. Damn, it's the doctor. He's been laughing this whole time. It's a steamy like a boiling pot. I'm never, ever, ever, ever gonna forgive him. The doctor only thinks about himself with power to enter TVs. Now I'm a tummy too. How did somebody who didn't understand anything get a power like that? What's wrong with this world? But the other one. No, Yosuke san and Chie san is a small bizarre room where we found a dachi. It already exists in your first visit there. It's weird. It's most likely something similar to my so called secret lab. Lots of those enter the TV creating a place that must have occurred before we went in as well. It's a place created by Miss Yamano's thoughts. I have a feeling she harbored to produce those faceless posters in a noose. I mean, we'll be entering Adachi san's inner thoughts? Ugh, that sounds like a recipe for disaster. What you went? What are you wimping out for? Remember that bastard's been uh, con us this whole time like he was on our side. All this time when we were risking our lives, the time when the king moron died? Dojima saw an accident even when Nanako chan was about to die, damn it! Yeah, to do with his damn crimes. You can't forgive this him give him as a person. I think Nanako's the killer and Adachi was being gaslit. You know what? I you might be right. Mm -mm, I totally agree. I don't know exactly how this end of the year Adachi mentioned is, but everyone we get will be useless if we rush things and get ourselves defeated. Let's make sure we're ready. Crush Adachi. It's time you paid for everything he's done. Alright. Enter the TV. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Adachi baby as soon as we can, right, Sensei? The directions today. Alright. Why do we keep saying Adachi baby? God, this place is spooky. I don't like it. Accurate though, damn. Mm -mm. I was expecting to see something horrible, but uh, um, this is weirdly funky. I told you to come after- I told you to come after me and you actually came. Don't worry guys, have anything better? Don't you guys have anything better to do? What a bunch of losers. Let's find the culprit ourselves. Let's meet up at the special headquarters today. Am I right or am I right? Man, it's embarrassing. How old are you guys? Ha ha ha. Oh crap, my stomach's hurting. Come on. You know, students, right? Shouldn't be studying instead of wasting your time with this. Study hard again. Do a good college. We're in a respectable company. Marry a cute girl. Why are you guys so desperate when it comes to something so useless? Once you get it, once you're adults. What's up with this guy? Out of all the things we've dealt with in this world, he pisses me off the most. We're not letting him get away. This song slaps. What's this song? Oh. Watch it. That one's immune to electricity. No. No. Oh, hell yeah. Persona. Kill the long way. Nice. Persona. 
Persona Magic, uh, chess key. Let's do Endurance Set, why not? Broken road. <laughs> it's so puny. You... Hmm. Enemy down. Stay nice at it. Move, senpai. You know, I kind of expected Go, a Dachi's like. Um. I guess I kind of expected like a Dachi's like. Pal or palace or dungeon or whatever you want to call it to be a bit more spooky. It's like not even that spooky. <gasps> no XP. I could do this. And then this. Yeah, it's surprisingly not spooky. Might get worse. Uh, maybe, I guess. Funny little guy, how fucked up could he be? I'm worried the answer is a pretty fucked up. Divine pillar, what's that? My friend's dodging. Hmm. Excuse me, shadows. Oh, it's a shadow. The, the yield sign is a shadow, nice. Hmm? Huh? Oh, where are we? Sorry, give me a sec. <gasps> Senpai, I can't find any exits. Oh no, what should we do? See, told you, students should go home and study. I get you listen to me. You'll never become well-behaved members of society if you keep this up. Oh well, have fun in there. Maybe we just have to make our exit or something like that. Ah, the naked lady's back. Lights no good on this one. You can four enemies left. Don't give up. There's still three. Damn. Here I go. Holy shit, Naoto. Ooh, that looked like it hurt. Stop being a jackass. Difficulty impossible. He is a jackass, I'll say that. can't actually level up a skill, sadly. So we'll just do all of these. We'll just keep uh, Crank and Izanagi up to 11. Look at Lucky Bun schedule, and they had you featured. Oh yeah, me and Paige are good buds. 
Is the person with your long ass sword gray hair flowing back here supposed to look so much like a fem sephiroth or a femperoth? Femperoth is a great name. Fantastic, even. They, I got it kind of does. I guess it's like the gender bent version of the main character, so you could say kind of, kind of femperoth. But it really do, it really does look like a female sephiroth. How are you, though, say? What's going on? No, I guess. Mm -mm. That's great, though. I've never heard somebody make that comparison. Perfect. Get lighted. Nice. Oh, well, I'm just working on homework. Nice. Mm -mm. Is it fun homework or not fun homework? Uh, I want a chess key. How about the game in? We are in... Oh, Uriel! Nice! We are in the climax of the game, which is to say... Uh, the climax of the main game? The golden content comes after. Uh, but pretty good. I got most of the stuff done I wanted to, but I'm a little curious where things are gonna go. And this dungeon's not what I've expected it to be, so we'll see. Also, like, gigantic Persona 4 spoilers, if you care about Persona 4. Like I said, I'm at, like, the climax. Mm -mm. Though I guess, like, if I'm, if I'm just, like, here... <laughs> if I'm just here, uh, in the dungeon, there's probably not that many spoilers, but... I don't know if you care about Persona at all. Keep it down. Keep going, senpai. That's great, senpai. You really get me going. Uh, I will. I will have. I will have a chance to progress links. I believe. Ice won't work. It is possible. You can win this. It's like I'll be able to finish I. And maybe the ball boys. Um, I could try to finish Yosuke, but. Uh, eh. Eh. Don't think I'll be able to, and I don't particularly care to. Finish I. Oh well. Not like that. She's a nice lady. Besides, I already have a girlfriend in this game. And we are faithful, we are committed. Boy, this sure is a labyrinth, jeez. Reese wasn't kidding. Okay, it's a giant loop. I'm gonna play at some point, but these games are so lighthearted, I can't imagine spoilers affecting my enjoyment. There's programming in Python. Ooh, programming. So it depends how much you love tabs and syntax. Uh, I am not a, I'm not a programmer girly. <laughs> what outfit is that? Uh, this is the like gender swap outfit. Still by some strong force. Aha, that's right. As you've guessed, I'm waiting for you guys just to be on here. You really think I just let you through? <sighs> Has to be another way to open this. Let's look around for clues. Hmm. It's like the gender bent version. Um... Yeah, no, Persona's good. I would recommend Persona 5 wholeheartedly. Persona 3 is also probably pretty good because it's just getting its, like, re-release. Um, don't play Persona 4. Especially if you came from Paige's stream. And I don't mean that in a bad way, uh, but I'm assuming you're really cool and have good taste. If you if that's where you came from. Um, so don't play this game. <laughs> um, it is wild. Watch someone else play Persona 4. There you go. Don't spend money on this game. <laughs> this is the closest we get to a Femme Pro tag. You betcha, baby. So I can try beating that red one, maybe? I don't know, that'll do something. But yeah, programming. That is not a me thing. I'm not a computer girly. 
My roommate is, though. My roommate works in tech. But I... I, I'm, I'm not, I'm not that good. If I have a computer problem, I, I ask, I ask her. But that does sound pretty cool. I hear Python's a good language. Outside of P3P, oh, and P2EP. Well, yeah, but they, they gotta be games I can actually play. You know, and I can't play them. Sweet, love darkness. Get darkness. P3P is on PC, and I do own it. Just the result I expected. All right, senpai. So I can definitely play it. My level has risen. Maybe that's enough? So that was the that was the only red enemy here. Do I have to find something else? Okay. Yep. Bum bum bum. Music still bumps though. What's the map button again? No, no, I don't want to send an SOS. No, I didn't. I don't. I didn't mean to. Uh. Hey, Rise, girl, what am I missing? Is it this hole? There's a hole in the ground. Jump in? Yeah, sure, why not? This place. Oh, you're able to escape. Not bad, not bad. You guys are better than you look. It was different from where we were before. I just have complete control of the area. Just like that door we couldn't open. Don't go that easily. Be careful, senpai. Yeah, things got redder. Very red. There's a hole there. It's now gone. Uh, oh, that's not good. What's with these work. gooey guys? Why are they so gooey? No problem. It'll be over in a flash. Yearning pot? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm pretty sure this is just what I look like in the morning, the complete with the pink hair and the goo. Love light. Light him up. <clears throat> I am also weak to light. I burn easy. Well, actually, I really don't burn that easy. Barong, hi Barong. How are you? Judgment, no effect. Uh, let's get a chess key, why not? Oh, did I level up? Alright, gamers. Let's open. God, this is such a weird dungeon. Neo. There's the exit. Python is fun, but sometimes programming can feel like you have to anticipate something that claims to work one way to totally fail, but you have to completely rework. Oh, it's a hand. Um. Oh, it's a big hand. Don't let it get away. It also completely work fundamental piece of logic get around it, but also sometimes brain just gets too smart and go burr. Hell yeah. I mean, it sounds pretty fun. Thanks, Risei. Three enemies left. 
What the fuck? Why did it reflect that? What that f what what? <laughs> Two remaining. Retaliate, presumably. Huh. Well, I'm glad I didn't die. Anyway, die. Yeah, Rise, go. What the hell? The hand did take it personally. These hands are my nemesis. Got him. And he does have 8,000 HP. You were right. <laughs> Damn. Hi, Siegfried. Yeah, deal him cards. Why not? Uh. Yeah, that's great. Say. Say. Say, say. Say. It's say, right? That's cool. Ooh, congratulations. I leveled up. Mm -mm. I leveled up. I'm more of like an English gay myself rather than a math gay. So like, you know, that's that's more my field of expertise. But hey, I respect it, that's pretty cool. Nice. Thank you, Risei, that's pretty cool. Oh. Actually, you know what? Let's just go up. Go up or, or down? I don't know where are we going. Up and... Guys, never give up. What are you trying to accomplish? Putting yourselves in danger like that? Trying to see justice done? Is that really justice, though? You're just doing it with this because you want a little spice in your boring lives. The difference between that and a criminal who gets his kicks by murdering people. A lot! See what I'm getting at? Still a lot of time left. Give it some thought. Honestly, I can't completely deny what he said, but that doesn't justify what he did. Right, senpai? Mm -hmm. No, justice was Nanako. This is judgment. You betcha, baby. We're gonna kill his ass. Mm -mm. Really not to flex too much, but I have a degree in professional writing. And the major got me into programming? Huh. Well... Cool. <laughs> no, I mean, that's great. Are you in, like, grad school then, or are you just going to, like, uh... Nice. Just going for, like, other stuff? Weak to ice, huh? Rude. It's weak to darkness. Let's go. Wow, Nasa Kun, you defeated two physical attacks. No, that's pretty cool. I'm just silly and play video games and read books. Yes, I leveled up. And I'm also right about every uh, video game I play. Mm -mm, sweet vindication. Oh, be careful! Oh my gosh, when I get, want to get back to tech industry, we're having a falling out, so we're not really speaking to each other. I'm sorry to hear that. Mm -mm. I believe in you, though. Why do you keep dodging? What is your deal? What is your deal, friend? Uh. Why are these bitches dodging all the time? Are we to light? Wait, 
Like fun content people want to pay for. Okay. Eh. Mm -mm. That's fair. Mm -mm. Light will work on it. This We're like it's really more like I get people will like throw money at me uh for made outfits. That's one thing, but also uh, for me to, uh, scream at video games. <laughs> to go feral over them. But I mean, like, that's understandable, I think. Mm -mm. I haven't really been that feral this stream, though. Probably because we're just, like, porn to the end stuff. Get made fun of? You want to get made fun of? I need to change that. I still haven't done that. Tilting is in my blood. Nice! Who do you play in Apex? I like getting to Apex like every other season. Mm -mm. It's fun. You were fair a last P4 stream though. You bet ya baby! <laughs> you, you bet! Because uh, you being feral if you want me to share, Sammy. You're always welcome to, Nomad. I won't stop you, but also, uh... Is there strong against lightning? What are these guys strong against? You're a crypto main. Uh, nice! I... I am a... I am a die-hard, uh, Watson player. Love Watson. Love my little French girl. Yo, love darkness? Mm -mm. Grass run in the maid commands. We should do something like that again. Maybe for Persona 3. Now then, what's next? Maybe like a different costume. You know, the, the Ada stuff, I never got all of that, by the way. I don't know if I told you. Like, it, like part of it came in, but I'm still waiting for another piece of it. Because apparently it wasn't all of it. Mm -mm. Watson players are just great. I don't make the rules. It's just how it is. You've become even more dependable. So I could try that. I mean... Or I could just like roll with it as is. I, leveled up. I know we already we already did a bunny suit and a maid outfit. What more is there in life? I think somebody suggested like a nurse outfit or something, but like that feels like medical malpractice, you know? Bunny maid. <laughs> no, <laughs> not both. <laughs> That just, that's just rehashing old concepts. <laughs> cat? I guess I've got cat ears. I live with a cat. Made bunny? Hmm, now you're talking. <laughs> um, hmm. The table? Perfect. Sexy librarian! I mean, what? I don't know, this is getting into a weird territory now! What would even be like, is sexy librarian just like wearing a pencil skirt and glasses? Isn't that like what it is these days? Dame Aelin, the librarian. <laughs> ah! Oh no. Oh, bad. Those are bad sounds. Ah, oh, time to go. Goodbye. Yeah, basically, maybe like a couple buttons undone. Ah, yes, because all of the cleavage that I have, that will work. Yeah! Okay, what a good idea! <laughs> Shadow Zumi just had yellow contacts and be sassy. Er? I'm pretty sassy already. I feel like Shadow Zumi would be really quiet. Sports, this is not a sports bra. I wish it was. <laughs> I, <laughs> I, look, every, like, this is, this is a real thing that happens, but like every once in a while, look, crawling boats can be sexy too. <laughs> I'm going to strangle you uh, for fun. No, like every once in a while I move through my life and go, you know what? Maybe I am at peace 
with my chest size. Like maybe that is okay. Maybe maybe things are okay. I am pretty cute. I'm, I'm downright adorable. People love me. People think I'm attractive, right? Everybody does. Then every once in a while, I'll, I'll, I'll just see somebody who just breasts a little too boobily and I'll just be like, why can't that be me? Like, you know, I don't know. I'm basically a weeb's wet dream. So like that, I got that going for me. I just need to find a weeb. It's not weird, which that, that's going to be pretty hard. <laughs> it was going to make no bad, <laughs> make no bad cosplay a corpse. <laughs> you bet I am. <laughs> Flat is justice. So they say, and yet I feel like a crime. Anyway. I like anime. <laughs> Flat is rare and that's more fun. Is it rare? Is it really? I'm just a really skinny bitch. I feel like I should link that anybody to... <laughs> Nomad, run. I'm behind you. <laughs> I'm just gonna like appear behind you. And throw- I'm gonna throw you into a TV! I know, knowing me, I could probably still have like a sexy librarian outfit with buttons undone and people would still be like, oh. People would still think I'm happy. If you have scoliosis or like a pinched nerve, justify it that you don't need to weigh down your neck more. That's how I do it. Hell yeah! See, look, I can- Well, I basically did nothing. <laughs> Too hot for Twitch. Nah, 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 nah. If I'm topless, it's fine, so long as you just see everything above the nip. The new meta. Remember when that was the thing? What happened to that? Did everyone just, like, calm down about that? What happened with that? Mm -mm. Did I see you guys leap through window? <laughs> nah. I don't know. Like, I'm I'm adorable, and I'm sexy, and I'm hot, and that's awesome. I just wish I had bigger boobs sometimes. I don't even have to be that much bigger. Just, like, a little bit, you know? Just, like, a little bit. But I'm genetically cursed. My family has a lot of Irish blood in it, so that means uh, a lot of skinny bitches. Mm -mm. I think Twitch reversed it and started banning. Did they? Oh, Aerith. There's an idea. I'd love to do an Aerith, but, like... Rebirth isn't coming on PC for a hot minute. I still hear this. Play surprisingly boring, you know? Why don't we play a game to pass the time? Let's see. How about this? You can't encounter shadows to here. Try to people without the shadows to catch you. Ready, set, go. Oh, this guy gets on my nerves. Will we forgive him for this? Hell yeah. Do it was careful. You don't blind us with all that bright white and Nomad, your death will be slow! <laughs> Aerith and heck of lesser RPGs, that would be kind of cute. That would be kind of funny. Hmm. I could try to just do the Ada cosplay. That wouldn't hurt. Like I said, I do have some of it. I've just been waiting for like the last piece to come in. I don't know if that fucker's ever gonna come in though. Mm -hmm. It would be fun. We haven't we haven't had a little like cosplay stream in a while. That'd be kind of cute. I want I I do want to do that stuff more. I just like I just get so like fucking busy. And then like with the move recently, oh wow, I'm surprised we made it this far. As a reward, I'll fight you. Continue through. Oh. Oh. Is there? You know what? No. Actually, you know what? Fuck you, dude. I'll fight you too. I'm lying, of course. Like, I'd ever do something like that. Okay. Oh, yeah, do you deserve to fight against the shadows? Damn it, I thought this was a dachi for a second. Uh-oh. That one's immune to darkness. 
Hey, don't summon more? Bad. Two enemies left. Don't lower your guard now. Classic female delinquent Sukiban look? You know. That's a good idea, Nomad. Ah, damn it. Hmm. I can't defeat it. What more of them? Three enemies left. You can win this. Come on. Hmm. Take a good idea is a once in a red moon. That would be kind of fun, actually, to get like a long skirt. And like some chains and shit. Hmm. Well, I still need to do that like uh that like Makoto cosplay too. I was planning that for Persona 3. So I'll get that I'll get that stuff given given together. Maybe after that we'll do something like that. That'd be kind of fun. Wait, does Sukuma literally translates to girl boss? I mean, I am kind of a girl boss. Um, like definitively. So Let's go. Only skirts, chains, fingerless gloves. Because I bet both, like, I bet the stuff that I could use for both of those can, like, um, the stuff I use for one could fit into the other. So that's a good idea. Everyone's charged up and focused. Fuck yeah. Now die. That's a good idea. I should do that. You know what, Nomad? I take it back. Your death will be quick. Huh, you're better than I thought. But how long can you keep it up? Come play that any chance of stopping us. Let's go, Senpai. She is Senpai. You look oh yeah, she did get beat up. Uh I haven't done this in a while. There we go. Yay! <laughs> Chest. Eye of Thunder. <laughs> like a real adult now, immediately came home from work and poured me some liquor. Yo, for real, I feel like an adult every time I go to like, oh, it got redder. Um. I feel like an adult every time I go and buy liquor, and they're like, I need to see an ID, ma'am. And I'm like, ha ha, ID. And they're like, all right. And then I take my rum and leave. Yeah. And we'll continue until morale approves. No! Mm -hmm. Oh, you a rum girl? Oh yeah. Hell yeah. I don't think I've ever been ID'd for liquor. I am ID'd every time. Because I look so young. Um, yes, I rum is my favorite alcoholic beverage. I don't like most alcohol. I don't. But I do like rum a lot. My mommy's excited when she gets ID'd. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Um, I like vodka, too. I like rum, I like vodka. I'm trying to, like, get into wine because my goal is to become a MILF one day, and I have to like wine. So, that's my goal. I also have to get a child, but, I mean, I think currently my roommate and I are co-parenting, uh, the cat. So, that kind of counts, right? Rum, eh? Recruiting for the British Navy in your spare time, then. What? No! Oh, no, I would never recruit for the British! They're my mortal enemy. Also, Ashley lives there. Our wine selection is way too big. I believe you. Yep. 
Um, I hate beer, though. I, I am not a beer girl. Hate beer. Uh, not a fan at all. I like sweet stuff. I like sweet things. Uh, because I'm so sweet. Um, but I like sweet things. So, like, beer is just, like, way too bitter. And carbonation, I don't like carbonation. That's my issue with wine, is a lot of wines, you know, pretty carbonated. So I gotta, like, not drink too fizzy of stuff. I did have a friend over recently, and he's like, oh, try this wine. And I actually liked it, so I'm sure I can get there. Small batch bourbon, please. Bourbon, I see, I see. Are you gonna get away with being a milk that doesn't do wine if you do, like, a vodka cranberry or, like, a Cosmo? I, I do like me a vodka cranberry. I do like me a Cosmo, but like, I got, I gotta be a mil, I gotta be a wine milf. I'm trying, I'm trying. I'm as vodka with cranberry, orange spritz and lime juice. I like, I just really like my like peach rum with lemonade. Just like rum and lemonade is like pretty nice. Um, I had an, like, I had an, like an orange peel, like vodka. Like kind of thing would be pretty good. You could be a vodka milf. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh, goal is to be a milf. Goal is to be a milf and you know, like, I don't know. I don't know if I want to say that I want kids or be like a tiki drinker milf. Oh, yo. Like a cat counts. What do I find alcohol actually? Like whiskey has come close. Really? Oh, you don't drink. That's fair. Sammy transforming into Roxy Lan... Lanade? Who's that? Gin Milfs are... Gin Milfs and Dilfs are like top tier. Hell yeah. Milf is a state of being, really. Hmm, I see, I see. Homestuck coming... Oh, it's Homestuck. Don't worry about it. Sorry. I did. I have strategically deleted everything I know about Homestuck out of my brain. Um, so it takes me a while to get those references, you see. I, I, I really try to avoid it at all costs. I can't. I can't. I, I can't go back. Um, anyway, yeah. Uh, MILF is mil MILF. Or really, do I want to be a MILF or just, do I just want to date a MILF? I just, I really like older women. I just really like older women. Like, that'd be pretty sweet. Those are only thing I have amazing alcohol tolerance. I just hate the taste of it. That's funny. I... You're all going to make fun of me when I say this, but I have a very low alcohol tolerance. Um, so it takes me very little for me to get, uh, shwasty. Um, which is good, because it saves me a lot of money, honestly. I can, I can, like, take one drink and I'm already like, ooh, well woozy. You do keep saying you're skinny. I, I weigh less than I should, probably. <laughs> I also usually drink pretty loaded drinks, especially if I pour them myself. I'm jamming. Yeah. Anyway. Alcohol. Alcohol usually hits me pretty hard. I imagine you glow like a cherry red lobster. I... I don't think I do. I don't think I get that red. I think I get like a little peachy. I get really... I get really sway. I know that. I... I, uh... Look, the party, the party girl in me really just wants to bust a move. Wine singular aunt. Wine aunt is pretty good too. I have sisters. Friends back when I went to big parties would do the like shots and I like thought I could keep up by like round two and their of their twenty rounds of drinks I'm down. Yeah, that's fair. I'm like the same way. I ever thought about the truth you all ever wanted so bad? Who really wants it, huh? Isn't it just you guys? What good is the truth if you're the only one satisfied by it? So you just want to satisfy yourselves. One to two, one tequila, two tequila, three tequila, floor. I know it says they have low alcohol tolerance, so he develops better tolerance when introduced to soju. Oh, you know, I don't think I've ever had soju. I should try it. 
Sure is getting at them, but the murder victims won't be able to rest in peace like this. Isn't that right, senpai? True. I got goalie or delicious though. I've never had soju. I probably should. I feel like I'd like it. Hmm, now what could you be weak to? It's weak to physical attack. <laughs> <laughs> Those are dangerous. Ever had sake? Want to try it? <laughs> I definitely know where I can get some. My brother-in-law actually works for like a liquor distributor. Um. So it'd probably be pretty easy just to ask him. Drink vodka. Oh, Thor! Miss that funky guy. Um. Oh, Nebros. The Hamo Mudo can, uh, combo continues to be very silly skills. They're just so. like. It's just so wild. They're so strong. It's so strong for like no reason. I gotta keep up my training. Excuse me? Naruto is so well balanced, not extremely fucking OP at all. Yay, and Naruto just kills everything. Yeah, Naruto, and they're like, alright, here's the best character. Uh, everything is easy now. I'm like, damn, I guess. Everything's so red. Bum, 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 bum. Stairs are right there, look at that. <clears throat> yeah, no, I like alcohol. I should drink more. I should party more, honestly. I really enjoy it. The problem is I'm friends with like a bunch of introverts, um, whom I love very dearly, of course, uh, but I am friends with a bunch of introverts. So I'll be like, I'll be like, yeah, let's like, uh, like, you know, let's go to this bar. Let's go to this place. Like, let's do this. And they're all like, Looks like that one's immune to win. <laughs> I'm like, okay, we don't have to. Ah, <sighs> we don't have to, I guess. That's great, so well done. You really get me. No. <laughs> <laughs> Keep start. going, senpai! <laughs> Give me a sec. I'll do a quick scan. I should work Once you hit 30, everything Just falls starts to fall cool. apart. This not over. Uh, you know, I, I gotta say... Uh, imagine having friends. Enemy Sorry? Let me do this at the ready. Um... Yeah. House parties? Eh. I mean, like, I, I've suggested similar things, and people, we do it sometimes. Not as much as I'd like to. I'm gonna be honest though, I'm not here for perpetuating the myth that somehow your life starts to fall apart after you hit 30. Like, I hear enough every day about how I'm gonna age into like a hag and die because I'm so ugly. So like, nah, I don't, I don't think going into your 30s is that bad of a thing. I'm gonna be real. I'm gonna be honest. Like, like, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be honest. I really don't think it's that bad. Well, not life, your body starts to fall apart. I mean, like, does it really? Like, honestly, like, if you exercise regularly, if you eat healthy, and like, I don't know, I know plenty of like 30 plus year olds who are pretty damn healthy. <laughs> 30s are just the sequel to 20s, real. So like, I don't know. My wreck is because I was in a literal wreck. Also, hi, hi Mary. How are you, sweetie? 
Maybe in late 30s, nobody here can. Uh, oh no. You're on the cusp of turning 30, you're allowed to lame it. Otherwise, don't worry about it. Well, I am not. Like I said, I don't know. I just, I don't think it's going to be that bad. In a weird way, like, part of me almost enjoys, like, like, look, I'm just excited to have my frontal lobe finally snap into place. And that's kind of cool. <laughs> um, that's been nice. Like, people hype up your 20s so much when, like, I'm going to be real. I had some of the worst experiences of my life when I was, like, you know, um, in my 20s. I can safely say that. I'm still in my 20s, and I guess things can get worse. Um, but, like, as I age, I get more emotionally stable, and I enjoy myself way more. Like... I have- I am having more fun as I am getting older. That's absolutely a thing that's happening. I'm having way more fun. I have more friends. Uh, my work-life balance is not perfect, but it's better. Um, like, I definitely have more money. I have way more independence. Um, in finan like I said, financial situation, not perfect, but it's better. Um, like... You know, and, like, I feel like I've be become less insane. I'm still, like, a little crazy. We all know that. That's never gonna go away. But, like, I, I have gotten more, like... You know, I think it's that frontal lobe is starting to kind of lock into place a little bit, where I, I feel like I I'm a bit... I'm a bit wiser. Now that I've, like, learned more things, you know? I don't know, like, it... There is a... There is a kind of simple joy in being able to just, like... you know, exist. There's absolutely a mess in my 20s. To start doing cosplay while holding 35 and starting therapy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 30s are great, honestly. Things figured out, greater chance of stability, I love it. Yeah. Congrats, I feel like it's a good thing. I don't know, it, it just feels like I have the ability to do more than things I actually want to do. Oh, did I level up? I gained a level. Hmm. Yes, I leveled up. You know, and, and I guess for like kind of an aside too, it's just kind of nice to like grow more comfortable in like my body too. My body and like who I am and stuff and things that are happening. You know. All that jazz. It's 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 nice. It's it's legitimately nice. Mm -mm. Oh no. I don't think it's that bad. I'm telling you it's a serial killer. That's what society accepts as the truth. Everyone fiercely latching onto it. So you guys catch me and truth is proven false. What do you think will happen then? You don't get it. It's simple. So they'll latch onto that instead. Nothing about them or the world will change. The truth is that you're all looking for. Jeez, what a smart ass. What's with this guy? Blabber about logic, tried to dodge the truth all he wants, but he's done, he can't, what he's done, he can't be forgiven. Like a pay for his crimes. Let's go, senpai. We're not going to forget to save. We're not going to be that silly. Anyway. My point being is, don't be afraid to age. Because, you know, life's hard. And sometimes that wisdom is in fact worth it. You also just kind of keep figuring things out. It's just like a continual process, you know? Sloppy. <laughs> Say, thank you so much for the... Um... Thank you so much for the follow. Also, Bloop, appreciate it. I hope you're an absolutely wonderful day. Because my day a bit more wonderful. Love you so, so, so much. Welcome. Oh, you know what? I know we're gonna go bother. 
We're gonna go bother uh, my, my good friend and teammate, Alchemy, who is uh, busy doing some FF14 business, some FF14 raiding. If you'd like to raid, there's the Awooga Booga right there. My socials are there, Discord, Twitter, YouTube, the whole nine yards, um, all the jazz. We made good progress today. We did, in fact, get into the dungeon, so that's good. Um, sorry, I couldn't catch this, but I love the bottom of this stupid ass game. <laughs> love you, Lily. You're great. Um, but uh, yeah, no, I look forward to seeing you guys on Wednesday for Baldur's Gate. We're doing Baldur's Gate. God, I hope we make progress in that game. It's so fucking long. Um, as for Persona, next week we're hopefully going to finish the base game and start on the golden content. I'm gonna cheat, keep trying to go as fast as I can so we can get to Persona 3. Um, but we made a lot of good progress today, so that's been great. Um, also, you guys are great too. Thank you for stopping in. Thank you for being around. Thanks for meeting you. Um, remember, love yourself. It's important. Or don't, and then I'll love you for you. You know what I mean. Anyway. I will see you guys later. Say that alchemy. See you on Wednesday at two. Goodbye. See you later. Bye. Bye.